Um, what I do, I'll, first of all, I'll tell you everyone's name so you're clear who it is. My name's Steve and I'm a policeman and I work here at Barnet Police Station. This lady here, her name's Cleo. Cleo and Steve. Cleo she and work Steve. With, um, Jean Clement. I know, I haven't met Jean Clement, but we do similar jobs, but he works in a different part of London, does it? I think he works. South. Some, so, yeah, somewhere else. He so Woodbury. I've never met him. I've never met him, but he does work. He is a policeman. Yes, he's a sergeant. Oh, is he? He's a police sergeant. Yeah, is yes. he? Oh, okay. And Cleo's a police lady, and her job is the controller today, and that means she controls everything that's going on there, making sure it's all working. Okay, and if you see, she had a pen and paper, and she might make some notes because she might want to ask something at the end. Do you want a pen? Um, and then from then, we'll just we'll talk. So that leaves one other person here, and that's you. Can I just ask you to say your full name, please? What's your first name? Elisa. Elisa. Well, my real my real name is yeah. Grace. Grace. But my name that that my name is Elisa Gareva Dearman, but my second name is Grace, as I said. So, Alicia Grace Gareva Dearman. Okay, so there's four names you've got. Yes. Okay, so, is, and have you got a middle name? Is Grace your middle name? Yes. And no other names? No, it's Grace, Grace. Okay, perfect. So, Alicia Grace Gareva Dearman. Yes. Okay, and how old are you, Alicia? I'm nine years. I was nine. I'm nine years old right now. Yeah. And so, do you prefer to be called Elisa or Grace? What one? Elisa. Elisa. I'm used to being called Elisa. Yeah, Elisa. Okay. I've been called uh, Grace. No. Okay. So, what I'd like to do is just go through some of the rules and just explain today's date. It is. It's half past ten in the evening, and it's the fifth of September, and. As I said, we're here at Barnet, and what we're going to talk about, I wasn't there. So because I wasn't there, I need you to explain in as much detail everything you can remember, okay? So just really think about everything that you can remember and tell me about it, okay? If I ask you something, yeah. you don't understand what I'm saying, yeah. tell me, yeah? And I'll look at a different way, okay? And that goes the other way. If you say something and I'm not really sure what you mean, I might ask you to say it again or I might ask the question in a we different have to way. Or something. Yeah, I might say, well, what does that mean? Or what yeah. can you tell me? And so that's that one, really. If I ask you a question and you don't know the answer, that's fine. Just tell me you don't know. Okay? And that's because I want you to tell everything the truth. Okay? I don't want you to guess. If you don't, if you don't know, just tell me, yeah, right. okay? And that leads on the next thing. We must tell the truth, and that's you and me. So if I ask you something, you've got to tell me the truth, and if you ask me something, I'll tell you the truth. Should we agree that, shall we? Yeah. What I want to do is just make sure you understand the difference between truth and a liar, okay? I've had this paper. Truth is, and also it's just opposite. Truth is what? Truth is opposite. Opposite well, to well, what? Well, lie is opposite. Truth. Lie is opposite to the truth. So, right, if I tell you this, if I've drawn this picture here, yes. this is on, on Cleo's paper, she sees this picture yes. and she says, who drawn that? I said, yes, it was me that drew it, I'm sorry. Would that be the truth or a lie? That would be truth. That would be the truth. So what would have been a lie? No, I did not draw it or somebody else, I don't know who. That would be a lie, yes. So, why do sometimes people tell the truth? Uh, sorry, tell the lie. Why do sometimes people tell a lie? So, because maybe sometimes they do. Maybe it's personal, I don't know. What do you mean? So maybe, like, if, I don't know. So, why would they stay, say a lie? Yeah, why would they maybe say a lie? Maybe they don't want you to know about that. Yeah, sometimes they yeah they don't want to tell you about it. Yeah. Maybe did they want to do, did they don't want to be in trouble? Did they want anyone to be in trouble? That's a, a, that's also a good reason that sometimes people lie. That's true, 
that people don't want to get in trouble and in here you won't get in trouble okay as long as you tell the truth you will not get in trouble for anything you've said or done okay as long as you tell us now okay is it, yeah and I promise that and I say I, I've got to tell the truth as well and from that um, I need to say that that includes if you use rude words or things like that in here you're allowed to use those rude words okay your, your mummy knows what we're going to be talking about and knows that you're here and she's, she won't tell you off if you need to use those sort of words I'd rather you use those rude words to tell me exactly what happened than try and make it polite and you miss out things that have happened so I don't understand well say for example me and Cleo were having a conversation and you heard Cleo swear yes. right? do you understand that bit? Yeah. so me and her talking Cleo swore while she was talking to me she yeah. said a rude word and then I say to you, did you hear what Cleo said? And I say, tell me what Cleo said. I'd rather you tell me everything, including the swear word. So I should, should, I should yeah. say... Say like said, oh, Cleo said, oh, oh this camera's shit. Say she um. said that. And I say to you, what did Cleo say? I, I don't want you to say, oh, Cleo said the camera's rubbish. I want you to say... Cleo said the camera was shit. Uh, Do you see? Yes, yeah, so I should. So don't try and make it polite. Yes. Say exactly. Is that clear? Yes, yeah, so I should say what like, exactly. Exactly. Perfect. Well done. Thank you. Um, so you've come here with your mum, and do you live with your mum? Do you? Yes, yeah, I live with her. And who else do you live with? Well, that's just my mum. I live with only my mum. No one else. No. No other family in the house. I don't live with my dad. No. What about brothers? No, I live with my uh, my brother Gabriel. So it's you, Gabriel, your mum. Yes, and I know. We're on it. We're in three. Three of you. Yes. Okay. And my big brother James, he sometimes comes. Oh, okay, and who's James? James is just my big brother, but he's not really like he 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 know he knows this about this, but no, he doesn't really like doing it. What do you mean? So my big brother James. Yeah, James. How old is James? He's about he's about seventeen, but he doesn't he doesn't he's not he doesn't is he's not really included because he doesn't really live with us. Oh, okay, so but, where's I, he? But live? he he lives with his dad, his like other dad. Oh, okay. Yeah, he, li he doesn't live with us, but oh, he okay. he he comes to visit us on Saturdays. Oh, I see. So is he your half a brother? Is he? Is no, he, he is my brother. He is my brother. Right. So it's just that his dad is married to not to so my mum married two men. Yep. So first is when when my big brother was born. Yeah. And after she broke up with his name is Will. Yeah. He broke up with him. Yeah. And after him she didn't marry but she she like she loved Ricky, which right. is my dad. Yeah. So then they so then we were born, so then we she broke Got it. up. So your dad is Ricky. Okay. James's dad is Will. Will. Will Draper and my mum's name is Ella Draper. And, but you and James both have the same mum who's Ella, yeah? Yes, yes. Understand. And what about Gabriel? Gabriel, yes, he's, the, he, he's my brother, yes. And is he the son of Will or is he the son of Ricky? Son of Ricky, me and uh, Gabriel are so, so, uh, the daughter and son of Ricky yeah. and James is son of Will. Perfect. So you live with your mum. Yes. And do you ever get to see your dad, do you? My my dad, Ricky. Ricky. Do you ever yes, get yes. to see him? Every, yep. two, every two Saturday. But actually, in fact, he lies to my mum. And he says that he just sees, he just sees us every two Saturdays. And do you That's see him every two Saturdays? That's the court orders. Okay. So do you see him every two Saturdays? Nope. And we see him every single day. Every single day, and how do you at do that? School, he comes to our school. Oh, does he? And what does he do at the school? He does does sex to us. He he kills babies there. Right. We eat babies. We drink their blood. Okay. Because this is how we, we do it. So like on Wednesdays, Wednesdays is the the most special, busiest days, special right. day. Right. Okay. We'll we'll start. We'll take it little bit by little bit. 
So you say your dad comes to your school every day. Yes. What does that mean? He comes that to means school every day. So that means he comes like whenever we have school on Saturdays. Yeah. He comes and sees us there. Whereabouts does he come and see you? My school, Christchurch Primary School. Yeah. Okay. Yes, that's where that's where we that's um the area we live we live next to yeah. Christchurch Primary School. Yeah. Because we live in Five Patterson Road, and then after he comes to our school. Okay. So who drops you off at school in the morning? My mum. So you get dropped off at school? Yes. When you get dropped off at school, what do you yes. do then? So then they check if the co coast is clear, if my, my mum's not there or anything around the area. Okay. Right. So they go, Mr. Morris, the, 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 the caretaker, Yeah. he goes around the school, uh, school areas and checks if my mum is there or anything, like if the coast is clear. Right. And after, after they call my dad and say that everything's all right, her, my mum is not there, is this air clear? How do you know that? Because that's because they got the number of my dad. And how do you know that? Because I heard them talking to my dad. That was exactly my own my, my da own dad's voice. Exactly. So where were you when you heard this caretaker speak? Staff to room. Dad? Staff room. Why were you in the staff room? Because that's where they do sex to me. Then. So, so you've got to school. Well, yes. You've got to school. You might. You've got. How did you get to school? So, so, so we just go and buy a car though. So you go by car yes. with your mum. Yes. Get to the school. Yes. So you get out of the car. Yes. And where do you go first of all? So then, so this is where we park, and there's this little path. You go upstairs, and then there's a little path, and then here's the big the, our school. Yeah. So then you just walk in, but the, the that's where the infants are. But you have to go further along, and that's where the junior, because right. I'm in junior. So then you, when you go d in the junior, there's downstairs and then there's, t and then there's a big playground and then there's this uh, office and s uh, the whole school okay. there. So you go into the school, in the infant's part, yes. and you walk around to the private Yes, so then at the front, when you just come in the room, okay. there's this, this an office, just office just at the front. There's a door going in the, in the hallway where we do assembly. Yeah. And on the right, no, on the left, you go in and there's this m the headmistress office there, okay. and then the staff toilet, and it's just this like where the teachers go and do yeah. the ty typing and work. Yeah. And there's upstairs there's your four and your five. Yeah. And after just like I'm in your four, so in your four yeah. there's just there, and then your five is there on that side, okay. and the staff room is just at the front of us. Okay. So just walk in the staff room and then there's this tea, there's this just this kitchen and then there's a sofa and that's where we okay. do sex. So why do you go in there first of all? Why don't you just go to class? No, we, we'd go to class sometimes too, yes. Right, so we so go to class sometimes, okay. yes. Okay, so you go to class? Yes. Okay, and then what happens when you get and to class? And then they got this, in my classroom, they've got this little door at the back, right at the back yeah. of the classroom. They've got a little door and it's just a little tiny little room. It's all stuffed with sweets, prizes, especially to pay the children with sweets to do sex to them. Right. Yeah, so they give sweets as much as they like. Yeah. So they so they give sweets so till they're like full, they're 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 done. So they because while they eat the sweets, they do sex to them. So they they pay them sweets and so and then after they do what they want them to do. Okay. Because they will. Because I would do children. Who, what children? What children? So the, there's there's load there's children from our school. Two hundred children in our yes. school. But it's not like all. Okay. Uh, there's twenty what special was? children. Tell me, who are these twenty there's, special children? There's Millie. She's a brown girl. Millie who? Millie Cowell. Millie Cow. Yes. Okay. So how do you know she's one of the twenty special children? Because she's because I know because she comes and she, they do sex to her, okay. mostly. Who's they? Who's they? The teachers, the parents, the staff. Every single teacher, or specific teachers. No, every single. The whole school does it. The whole, the whole school, and we got our own church yeah. too. So we, so because they do that, because after, we, as I said, we kill babies, we drink their blood, we eat them. Okay. But then after we, we, so the social services who are in it. Yeah. They, the, so they go to families, or so they go to families. So if the families can't afford, so they get a baby, but they can't look after it or anything. They can't buy food, or they they can't buy clothes. They can't look after it. 
So the sell the families who sell their children. Yeah. So the social services get them. They say they get them to a foster home, but they don't. They get the babies or the children, and then they then they it put they get Miss Marden, yeah. our nurse in our school. She injects the child or baby. In the in the net just here though. Right. Okay. And how do and you know that? Because I saw her doing it. I saw her doing it. How did you see her doing it? Because I saw her in the staff room. She was getting this. This. this so she got this okay. injection, and she did, done. So the baby was there. It was just sit, sitting on the table. Right. And I was just laughing there. And after she just injected her, and it was just like, it just like it was like, it was slowly went to sleep. But not like, not just like a thud. Not like just fell straight away. They just they put because it, it was like it was like it, was, it looked like it was slowly moving down like that. Right. Yeah. So okay. then after so they baby's gone to sleep. Yes, and then, and then after they get put put on this bit, they um get the baby to hang it upside down. And, and how's they hang yes, it over the string. From where? On a on a wall because there's this little this this little like um uh sw is a screw. And let's they put a string, it's like a circle string, yeah. tie it to the legs, hang it up, so down, and then they get a special the knife they use for the cutting the baby's head off. So you know this big, big, big ones like this this big Chinese ones yeah. which you chop up coconut and stuff. Right. Yes, they get cleavers, aren't they? No. Okay. Um, I don't know what they're called. You've described it well enough. Yes. Okay. So then, they sh because our dad, he forces me and Gabriel to do it, but because we can't, we're not strong enough to cut the baby's head off. He tells us to hold the knife, and he puts his hand at the top of our hand, and he helps us to cut the baby's head off, because he's learning, he's l he's teaching me and Gabriel so when we're older to do it to our own children and do this kind of stuff to our own and where children. is it this that happens um uh, the church in the kitchen in our church the kitchen in the church yes they okay. got yes. so right this string tell me about this string so it's, this it's just like it's not just like just a thin normal string it's a bit thick it's like maybe that that thick okay and they tie around, okay. like in a circle. Right. Hang it up on the on the. On where the do they tie it to on the baby? So it's like on on legs. So they put the legs right. together, tie it on. Yeah. And so it's like one string around, and then one string attached, yeah. and it's hanging upside down. Yeah. They get the 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 knife, the knife, but they don't just cut it off absolutely. This is still on. So it's they slide right. the head off, but it's still hanging on. So the Okay. Yes, and then the, there's a big white bowl on yeah. the floor, and the blood drips in, and then they we put we put it pour it in a, a big silver goblet. Okay, so where's this white bowl? Where do they get the white bowl from? They bought they bought the big white bowl. From where? From there's an, an any shop any white. And bowl. where do they but where do they get the but where did they get the bowl from this time? Any any shop any shop like this. So you know um. But you obviously didn't see them get. The bowl. No, I don't know. I don't know what shop. But I think I think they went to this. Uh, what is it called in next to Brank Cross? Okay. It's near. It's near Brank Cross. Um, where where is it kept at the? The in church. a cupboard. In a cupboard. What cupboard? There's this just just like a like a like a normal cupboard. So it's like you near know, like a cupboard, cupboard, like a kitchen cupboard. Right. Okay. So and where like is this kitchen cupboard? There's so there's a kitchen in the church right. and in a school. Right. There's a kitchen. Yes. I've got it. This kitchen. Yes. So we're in the kitchen. Yes. The baby's hanging up. Yes. And you said that there's well, a white yes, bowl. So then, yes. And it's kept in a yes. cupboard. So what cupboard is it kept in? It's just a it's just a wooden cupboard. So it's like. Okay. So if I was to go in the kitchen, how would I find it? Tell me how I can find so it. So like it's not as big as this room. It's yeah. much bigger, much okay. bigger. Right. So it's just like maybe just around, just around on this wall, just yeah. around here. There's this little cupboard. Right. It's not little. It's kind of a medium size. Right, there's a medium cup. So where's the door? In, so you, you describe yes, the kitchen. Yes, the door is a bit like that, a bit right. like that. So the door's over there. Yes. Then you said the cupboard would be in the other corner. Yes. Have I got that right? Yes. Yes. Okay. And is the cupboard? 
up up in the top or down yeah. on the bottom? No, it's at, at the top, so like in the, the top, middle, like that. Yes. And you say it's wooden. What colour wooden? Just normal brown wood. Okay. And there are any other cupboards around it? Yes, there is uh, some other cupboards like around the walls. So you know, like so lots and lots and lots. So it's just a few. If I come in. How can I go to that cupboard without making any mistake with the one of the other? So, cupboards? like, if you come in a room, here's this the sink, and here's this big yeah. table, yeah. and just uh, this little, this as I said, a cupboard. Okay. So you see this frame, and it says yeah. wish. Yeah. It's just it's the, a bit bigger that than that size, okay. and it's just that a bit that colour of wood, a bit brown. Yeah. And then it's just this cupboard, and it just got the normal handles, and then just. Like there's just wooden handles. Okay. So you have to open, and there's this white bowl and a silver okay. goblet. The the two things that we use, the pla okay. the plates that we use to eat the baby on, yes. So and they tell they tell me and Gabriel, but who actually killed the babies was my father. He kills the babies. Okay. So the baby's hanging up. And yes. You say, how do they hang it up? What do they use? You've got the string on yes. the leg. Yes. And what's it attached to? No, no, no. It's got a screwdriver on, on the wall. There's a screwdriver yes. on the wall. Whereabouts on the wall? It's just, it's just like a wall. It's, just, it's not like the same like this room. The door is actually there. Yeah, that, that's the, the, it's the kitchen where we actually do the, like, the, that's the u usual kitchen where we usually like so you go in go yes. through the door so yes. where's this screw on the wall so it's just it's just like the door the door pretend the door is just there yeah. it's another kitchen though yeah this is the kitchen that we usually use yeah so how do, how do i know that's a different kitchen what's different about this kitchen Look, where it, is this it? is just is this a different shape and it looks it looks different whereabouts is this kitchen in, the in school? our school in our school whereabouts in the school so it's just like this the school just um there's normal kitchen school. The kitchen. kitchen. That's yes, where they uh, make the school the school dinners. So oh right, the school canteen yes. kitchen. Okay, so it's in yes. there. So you go in the door, yes. where's the screw on the wall? So it's just just like there, it's just a this so here's the door when yeah. you come in. And there's this little screwdriver. Screwdriver. Wait, sorry, well, screwdriver. It's, it's not a screwdriver, a screw. Right, a screw. Yes, it's it's in the wall. Right. And but you've got a space on. Yeah. So you have to hang the the string on. Yeah. But you make sure it's still it's 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 like secure. Yeah. So they put it because they got the, because Mr. Morris he works he works hard he he works with hammers he works that yeah. kind of stuff. Yeah. So he he gets this 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 screw in the wall, and after he hangs it up, the, he hangs the baby up. Right, okay. And if Papa and me, yeah. they ho either me or Gabriel hold on to the yeah. life, but he actually kills the baby because he puts his hand on our right, hand. Okay. So then he says to swing and then just chop off the baby's head off, mm -hmm. but like stop straight away, like maybe for maybe so, like once, so you go like this one and then yeah. just leave a bit of space so it's still on the yeah. head. But it's it's better. It's just the blood is dripping in the bowl, though. That's how we drain out the blood. Okay, so you do that. Blood's dripping. Does blood not go like everywhere? No, 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 no. We don't make that. That we go like this. Like we don't just go like smash like yeah. that. We go like this. One like 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 not so speedy. Yeah. Just like medium speed. Yeah. So you just go like, like that fast. Okay. Like that, and we make sure it's not like blood spilled everywhere because they, we make sure that everything, everything is clean as much yeah. as clean as they can do it because they clean it after that too. Okay, so, so if this blood up. is on the floor or something mm. like that, they wipe it off. Oh, okay, yes, okay. Yeah. So, so blood's in the bowl, yes, and then, and then we the put blood? and then after we re, we go pour, pour it in the silver goblet. And and where do they get the silver goblet from? I don't know where what shop. No, but like where it. Yes, it's with with the white bowl in the same cupboard. In the same cupboard, yes. this wooden cupboard. And yes. That's not in this kitchen with the hanging on the screw. It's in a different kitchen. Is that right? Yes. Okay. Because they get the bowl from the other kitchen to Got that it. kitchen. Understood. So where are all the people that work in the canteen then when this is happening? I don't understand. Well, there's obviously, if it's a kitchen. Yes. To make, I assume. 
Is it to make all the children's lunches? Yes, but instead where, where, where instead of people? making those the children lunches, they put they give baby to the children. They give baby to the children. Yes, yeah, so they give like if they make if they say there's spaghetti bolognese that day, they put a bit of baby meat in all the time. And how do they make baby meat to use spaghetti? Because they, they get understand. they because they cut the baby Mrs. Forsyke, yeah. the headmistress, she cuts the baby. And what about all the bones and that? Yes, yes. They keep the where, bones. Where? But they where after, do they go? No, I know, but the bones they do just like keep them. They, they they make stuff out of them. Not so they much. make like statues of the Where church. Are these statues? Yes, because they got carving like there's people carving people. They work n near Swiss Cottage, somewhere there. That that's where they work in the carving shop. And it's just and then they got this. They got they tell the, there's a man called Felix there, and then he 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 makes this like he makes statues of ch churches. He makes that kind of stuff. Let's see, he makes. Sorry. Can you be quiet, please? We're just doing an interview. Cheers. Yeah, we didn't know that. Yeah, no, fine. Cheers. So it's just like they make they make like statues and stuff out of the bones. Yeah. Because they got car as I said, they got carving people. So yeah. like they got Felix, they got Max. Yeah. Those are the two people who are. The, like the best ones at carving. Yeah. So our church, we got our own church. Yeah. Yes, they make carving of that church, and then they s they don't just sell it. Yeah. They sell it sometimes, but they keep it. The school keeps it sometimes, yeah. but usually they sell it for money because they want money. And how do you know all this? Because I saw they have statues of them. Okay. So Felix makes statues. Yes, and, and the skulls of the babies. You know the skulls. Yeah. Yes, we they get the the skulls and they make hole they make make a hole with a driller so they make a hole in and then they put they tie a string around yeah. and then they put it all around the body but they're naked and they got this tattoo on the private with uh, like little piercings. Okay. Not like earrings but like little gold piercings around the private. Yeah. And they all dance around with skulls on in the church though. Okay. So they put, they have skulls like t the teachers and the staff. They got twenty skulls each. And how do you know they've got twenty each? Yes, because I counted once. They were like, there's one here, and then there's one here, and there's one on the neck here. Like they looks like like and like skulls everywhere on the knees, on the elbows. It looks like armor. Okay, so if I was to try and find these skulls, where would I yes. find them? Yes, yes, in the church. Where in the church. In the church? So there's this secret rooms. They got secret rooms. Go on, tell me how yes. do I find the secret? So when you go in the secret rooms, because they hide it in loads of places. So would you be able to help me find them? Would you? Yes. Okay. Yes, so but they just hide them anywhere. They just hide it like in one place, then they move to other place, then they move to other place. This just. Okay, so I go into the church now. Yes, and it, and they hide. Usually they hide it in their houses. Because they have parties that? in their houses. Okay. Because Mr. Hollings, you know my teacher, yeah. he lives in Highgate. Right. Yes. If you can see his mm. house, because his Porsche, yeah. he got Porsche, and it's just at the front of his house. Okay. So, how do you know he keeps them in his house? Because I know because I went to his his house once. Tell me about his house. What's it look like? It's big. It's big. It's okay. Big. big. We go in the front door. What colour yes. is the front door? It's it's just normal black colour, normal black. Normal black. Yes, so yes. We go. I go in. I've gone in to yes. Mr. Peter's house. Was it? Sorry. No, Mr. Hollings. Mr. Hollings. Sorry. Gone into Mr. Hollings' house. Yes. Through the black door. Yes, and then so there's this, what this do I go into? corridor. What there's a corridor. The corridor. Tell um, me about the corridor first of all. So there's a corridor, and it's just got like it's just like a little corridor, and there's this little table there, and the shoes there, all okay. his kind of shoes. Yes. Right. We'll stop there. Stop. Yes. Sorry, I don't mean to. It's rude of me to interrupt yes, you. Okay. Sorry. So we've gone into this corridor. You see, it's a small corridor. Yes. It's a table. Yes. With shoes. Yes. So tell me about the table. Tell me everything about this, this table. This table has got. It's not like it does not have stuff on. It doesn't yeah. have just like skulls on. It doesn't have that. No. It got just like maybe car keys. Maybe it got his jacket on. Okay. Maybe it got his bag on. I I don't know. Different kind of stuff. Personal stuff.
Okay, so this table, what does it look like? It's just like a normal, like a square table. So it's square? Yes. Because obviously, there are, like in here, like, someone could describe that as a table, this is a table. So no, they're all very different, aren't they? So tell me about, first of all, if you stand up for yes. me, stand up, can you stand up? So how high to you is the table? Mm-hmm. Okay. Here, somewhere here. Okay, so somewhere there. And yes. then what colour is it? It's just normal, like normal, just normal, like black colour, like this. It's just normal wood and black. Wood and black? Yes, so it's, it's wood and normal. black? Yes. Okay, so it's up to, so it's a little bit higher than this yes. table. It's wood and black. It's yes. square. Yes. So it's just like that, like that big. Like okay. that, that's the same like, like this and like this. Okay. And then, right, so that that's the top of it, yes. described, and it's square. Yes. And then, when you go down a bit, what's yes, there? Yes, it's under the table, there's shoes there, the, his shoes there, so, okay. like, all his different kind of shoes. So, his under shoes, the table, yes. keeps his shoes? Yes. Okay. And then, what about the floor? What's on the floor? On the floor, is just, as I said, it's just got shoes on. Okay, got but what's carpet. the floor? Car sorry? it got carpet on carpet. the floor, too. What sort of carpet? Well, it's not like like a carpet. Like it's not like carpet everywhere, everywhere. There's yeah. a toilet, like you know when you come in the house and there's just a, usually a small, like a small carpet, a carpet at the front yeah. of the door. Yeah. yeah, it got that, and then the rest is just wooden, what wooden, sort of just wood? brown. Just you see this coloured door, just that like that. So quite a, that shows quite a dark brown. Can you just yes. the camera to the door? So that sort of colour brown. So that's colour brown for his floor. Yes. So you go down the corridor. Yes. And then, what rooms are off the corridor? So let's so say where the where's this corridor? Here's the living room. Here's the kitchen, and then just there, there's this toilet, and then here's you go up the room, up okay. the stairs. Okay. So right. So go in. Yes. There's a living room. Yes. A kitchen. Yes. A downstairs toilet yes. and some stairs that go upstairs. Yes, yes. And have you been in all of those rooms downstairs? Yes. Okay. Tell me about the living room first of all. What's in the there? The living room. They've got secret rooms in there. What does that mean? They've got secret rooms in there. In the living room. Yes. Okay. Well, tell me about top secret. Top secret. Okay. If we talk about the not top secret bits first of all, tell yes. me about the normal bits of the living room. Yes, it's just like it's bigger than this. Okay, so it's a room bigger than this. Yes, it's, it's a big large room and then you've got a table, you've got a television, you've got a sofa, it's, it's like a normal living room. Okay. Yes, and just there, there's like a half part is a living room and a half part is a dining room. Okay. So it's like mixed rooms, That that's why it's big. Okay, so yes. it's a, got a living room and a dining room. Yes. Yep. And in one whole room. Has he got any tables or chairs or yes. sofas or anything yes, like yes. that? Yes. What's he got? So he got a television, just a, a big Samsung. Samsung. How yes. do you know it's Samsung? Because you can see silver writing Samsung on. Okay, so he's got Samsung telly, a big yes. one. And what yes. does that? What? Where is that telly? It's just like at the front. Like it looks a bit like a table like that, but it's a bit smaller. And it's a bit like this size, this like this okay. height. And how big is the that air thing? It's just the same size, but it's just this height. So it's as big as this, yes. but smaller. So about yes. this height. This. Yes. But okay. And it's just the television is done, and the sofas done. Tell it's me about table. the sofa. What sort of sofa? So it's you just got? like a, it's not like a sofa. It's not like 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 a like multicolored. It's, it's not just multi it's just like this, not brown, but it's kind of. Blackish, really, really, really dark brown. And what sort of size is it so far? It's like it's like this, but like if you join that chair to the sofa, yeah. so if it's like that, and you add a chair just here, so like it's, it's a join. So it's longer, is it? Yes, yes. And what about and then it, okay? So it's a long sofa, it's like that, like the, like this. And what shape is it? sofa. So it's like this, so you go, it's like that, the sofa, like okay, that. Okay, like an L shape. Yeah, it's like that. Okay. Yes. So it's got a, a bigger sofa than this, it's like a blacky colour. Yes, it's really, an L shape. really dark brown. Okay. But like much darker. And where does he keep the baby skulls? The baby skulls in his house, yes. Whereabouts? So, they, so then at the front, where the dining room, there's this big wardrobe. Yeah. And he just keeps maybe spare clothes or anything like that. Like yeah. Maybe like if there's like maybe plates, bowls, anything yeah. like that. 
Yeah. He just keeps it there. But it's not like the wardrobe is just like the skull's right in a wardrobe. Yeah. You can see it. Like you open a door and you can see it. Yeah. It's not like that. It's no. top secret in there. Go on, tell me how to find yes. it. Yes. So then after it's just maybe just because sometimes he keeps spare clothes, as I said. Yeah. So you've got a hanger and you've got just clothes, the coats, or anything like that. Yeah. There. And then after you have to apart the clothes. Correct. And there's a little okay. door there, but it's like it's like it looks camouflaged. You how can't you really mean? see it. So how would I be able to find it, the door? So, <laughs> so here's the clothes, but you can't see the door. Because the clothes are at the front of it. Yeah. It's all like all covered like that. Yeah. But you have to part the clothes, and after you can, see it's like it looks like a it looks like a just like a normal wall. Yeah. But it's not a normal wall. It got a little handle there. Is there? Yes. And what does this handle look like? How could I find it? It's like a, like not like a handle like that, but it's it's just still wooden. It's like like a bendy one, like like okay. like. How to say like that? Okay. And when I open that door, wh yes. what do I find? So then inside, there's you have to go downstairs to underground. You go so underground. Yes. yes. And what's in there underground? So then we go underground, and after there's this little hallway, and on the right there's this door, and then there's the big enormous secret room. And what's in the secret room? In the secret room, there's cupboards everywhere. Looks like everywhere, but then they do sex there too. Who, how do you know they do sex there? Because they took me there to do sex. Who took you there? My pa father, Mr. Hollings took me. So you're who? My father. Your father, sorry. Okay, do you call him father or papa? Papa. Is it papa. So papa's taking you down there. And what did you do there? So it's just like, say, so after you do sex there, so. What they does have sex mean? So like they have plastic, they buy plastic quillies. Right, okay. Yes, and then they, they, they strap it on. And but they make sure her they want plastic willies. They don't want to real use their real willies. Why not? Because it just doesn't hurt. They want to make sure it hurts. Okay. So who's they? So Papa and who else? Mr. Hollings, headmistress. Okay. So Papa, all the teachers. Mr. Hollings, the headmistress. Yes, Miss Marden, Mr. Fanoni, Mr. Gorge. Okay. So who done it when you went to that house? Who was there? So all all the all the staff all, all the staff all the parent you know the parents of all yeah. the children they all all know about it okay they do it okay and so you've got in there yes and who's used the plastic willies all of them all, all of, of them. them and where do they keep the plastic willies they keep them in the cupboards they got as I said they've got cupboards around okay so they got like maybe two cupboards there and two cupboards there they've got cupboards around all okay. around the room. Okay, so I'll make sh I want to just make sure I get this absolutely correct. So and they've got uh, exits, so if in case of because in case because they m they know that they know that because they they do not trust me and Gabriel. Yeah. That because they say that not to tell anyone about yes. this. Yes. Okay. But they do not trust us. No. Why no, not? because they can see them because they like, they because they when they tell us not to tell about the, this anything, they look so curious. So okay. they, it looks like they they that it looks like they're not trust. They don't okay. trust us. Okay. So I just get you right, Mr. Holling's house. Yes. I'll go there. He has a Porsche yes. outside. Then you go to the door. Yes. Dark door. Yes. You go into a corridor. Yes. It's got yes. a little carpet by the yes. door. Wooden floor, very yes. dark, like this door. Yes, yes. yes. On the on the sides of the, you show yes, me there. Yes, there's a living room at the front. There's a kitchen, and then there's the. There's there's a little table. Yes. Then you go into the living room. Yes. You've got a large sofa. Yes. Which is in an L shape. Yes. Big Samsung telly yes. on a large black shelf. Yes, thing yes. You described. You said in the dining room yes. area, he's got a wardrobe. Yes. Then and it's all just stuffed in spare clothes, if as you said. All stuffed with spare clothes, but if you part it, yes. you'll find a little door. Yes, but you can't, you can't, you can't really cellar. see it because it's kind of, like, kind of camouflaged. It's camouflaged. Like, yes, it looks a but bit But there's a little wooden handle. Yes, yes. You can open that. Yes. But they've got down. exits. The re thing is that they've got exits there because they can run out the house too. Right, okay. But... You go down into this, it takes you into a basement. Yes. And then in there, there's loads of cupboards. Yes, loads of cupboards and there's And in there, yes. your dad, Paso Papa, Mr. Hollings, some other members of staff. Yes. 
have then had sex with you yes. using plastic wallets. Yes, and then they touch each they're... other. Okay. And, it, and as I said, they sell me and my brother for £50 each to every who? single day. To who? To any people. Any people who, like, like any people who would, like, do, well, who are, yeah. like, the kind of people who will actually do sex to, yeah. like, who can't come to, our, to school, who are busy yeah. or anything okay. like that, but then they keep me and Gabriel yeah. to do sex to whilst they got their equipment. Yeah. Say so okay. they got a plastic quillies, yeah. and then they do it, and then after like maybe for two hours, maybe one hour, du during school hours. Okay, so the what is sex? Yes, what, we haven't said what sex is. What is it? So it, like sex, so they they touch each so they touch each other on a private, right. and okay. as I said, they well I didn't tell you about this, but they got this big plastic stick. Right. Yes, not not plastic, but wooden. Yeah. Yes, and then they put it between our legs, and they hit it right between us, but like, like in between our her legs. So they hit you with a wooden stick yes. between your legs. Yes. And what's what's that? Is that sex? Is it? No, no, no. What's but that's how they hurt hurt us. But a real sex is like they get plastic quillies. They put stick it in our bum. That's what kind of sex okay. they do. And what is your bum? So they stick it in a plastic quillie in a bum where oh, okay. so where the poo comes out okay so they put a plastic yes. willy in the bum where the poo yes. comes out okay. yes and anywhere else yes in our front private okay and then they you say our front private who are you talking yes. about yes no no so if they if they like if because if we sc if we say it hurts or if we cry or make a sound yeah. they'll give us spoon licks so they'll get a spoon, spoon licks yes. what does that mean so you get spoons and then they hit us hit us hit us on the head okay. That's why whenever we come back to our okay. mum, she always says, she doesn't say, but that's why we always got bumps on our heads. Okay. But she doesn't say, why do you have bumps on your head? She doesn't say that. Do you know how to get to Mr. Holling's house, do you? Me, from my, from our school. From our, from your school, do you? A bit. I know, I know some of the way. I know some of the way. Where, where could, if, where, if we took you some, where would you be able to find where his house is? So it's just like... I'd, is I do remember there's like the number of his actual house. But could you say say we drove near it? Could you yes. say yep, yeah, it's that one? Yes, I can f I can spot it because I know because he always park he when he no matter what yes. he always parks his Porsche at the front. Oh, okay. Always, I know or like okay. his car looks like I know. Absolutely. Do you know what street it's in? What the name of the street is or where? No, I don't remember, but I know it's Highgate. It's Highgate. So, if we went to Highgate, yes. would you be able to find the house? Yes. How if we drove you... around Highgate, yeah. drove around, and if I spot like a, like if I spot the house because I know how the house but looks. But obviously, like. there, say there's, there's maybe a thousand houses in Highgate. Yes, yes, yes. So how would you uh, how would you know where to go? No, how because you know we because to say, oh, turn left down this street. No, how but that's know? because because when me and my uh, Abraham, my mom's friend. And my mum and Gabriel, we go to this uh, our friend's house called Gary. Yeah. Yes, and then we uh, you go through Highgate. He lives near Highgate, so he goes. So when you go through Highgate, just at the yeah. bottom of Highgate, he lives there. So okay. then when we go through, I can also when you go through on the on the left, you can all that's the road where I remember that's around there. That's where his house is. So if we went to Gary's house, you'd be able to tell me from there, would you? Yeah. Yeah, but my 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 uh, my mum and uh, Abraham okay. knows how to go to Gary's house. Okay. So when we're on the way, I know. Yes. Okay. And has anything ever happened at your dad's house? Yes. What? My father lives at Angel Road. Oh, okay. But it's like on the corner, right on okay. the corner. Okay. What happened there? And so there's they got the same like Mr. Hollings. What? A bit same they a bit the same house, a bit the same in this they looks the same looks this like I said the wardrobe, this that okay. kind of stuff. That's a, the same. So they've got this little this stairs down says yes. Okay. Because, so yes. if I went to your dad's house, yes. get to your dad's house. What yes. colour doors his? Yeah, his one is kind of light lightish brown lightish brown so it's got a lightish brown door yes so go in there yes where's this wardrobe the in the living room as i said so a bit this, like like mr hollings so go to the living room and uh, what does this wardrobe look like 
It's not like Mr. Hollings's, but similar. It's long. It's oh. long. Okay, so go to the wall. Wardrobe. Yes. And how do I get through the secret door? How do I get into the secret door? Yeah, they got keys. They got keys to the door uh, because Mr. Morris, my father, uh, my, well, Papa. How could I tell there's a door there? So I go to the wardrobe. Yes. How would I know that it's not just the back of a wardrobe and it's a door? How could I tell? What's different about it? Was there's no difference. There's no difference. Where would you put the key then? I don't. No, no, no. There's no key to go in a yeah. wardrobe. Yeah. There's no key. Right, sorry. But I'm when you go down the stairs into the secret room right. underground, they got the room, the room in there. They got the keys to oh, it. Okay. Mr. Morris, Papa, Mrs. Forsick, Mr. Hollings, they got like big, big bunches of keys. I see. Big. So how do I get? So I open the open the wardrobe. What's in the wardrobe? So it's just stuffed in with clothes, like so spare in with clothes. clothes. Yes. So I get all the clothes out of the way. Yes. Then what do I find? And then after you find, it's just. It looks like just like a normal wardrobe yeah. wall because it's camouflaged yeah. and it makes sure yeah. you can't see it. Yes. So but how actually, do I find the door? door? Because it's just right in the middle. So here's okay. here's the here's like the, the this is the wardrobe. Would I be able to see so like the gap or not? No, it's come, it's a, like camouflage. So like imagine this was like red and then you, yeah. the, like imagine this was yeah. like this is this is the yeah. same colour. Would I be able to move the wardrobe out of the way and find a hole in the wall? Would I or not? No, no, no. That's Why no. Not? No, because you have to. The, the door is attached to the wall, right. and it got stairs going down. So if I move the wardrobe, yes, would I see the door? Yes, okay. but then if so is that the best thing to do? Then is it? Yes, sometimes yes, but okay. sometimes when they go in the wardrobe and they go downstairs, they close behind the, the door, and then they've got this another like it looks like like, an, like another brick wall. It looks like a brick wall door. And then they close it behind too. Right. So it looks like a double door. Let, let me just make sure I'm clear. So go to your dad's house. Yes. Wardrobe's there. Yes. I'll move the wardrobe out of the way. Yes. There's a door. Yes. I go down the stairs. Yes. And then what do I see down the stairs? Down the stairs, you go down, and as as I said, they've got a little corridor, a little hallway. Yeah. So then there's a little hallway, and then on the right, just here. Yeah. There's just the t then there's just the little another just a tiny tiny corridor. So maybe like from there, from yeah. here yeah. to here, and then just there's this door. Just okay. here, and then that's where the, the secret room is. But it got special keys, though. As I said, it got big bunches of keys. Got it. Understood. It got loads. Like, okay. Look, so if you go to Mr. Morris, yeah. In our school, if they, if you wait till our school, so today's Friday. Yes. So wait till Monday or Tuesday. Yeah. Go to our school, catch Mr. Morris. Yeah. He's a big tall guy. Okay. Well, catch the whole school. To catch all the all the staff there. What children? You told us one child to speak to. What other children? Yeah, Millie do you think Carol, we speak to? Sophie Herlika, Sophie Jack Herlika. Jones, Ella Darby, Mia Gavish, uh, loads of other children, loads. Okay. But me and Gabriel. Are, are any of these your friends out of school? Sorry. Are any of these friends of yours out of school? No, but Millie, yeah. Millie Carroll, she left school. Why? Because she does. She doesn't like it. She Where's doesn't she like gone the now? sex. She went in uh, Salisbury's. Salisbury. Yeah. Okay. Yes, but Lovely. still, sort of, because when she went to Salisbury, she thought that was the school it won't do because okay. other schools do it. So Hampstead Parochial do it. Saint Luke's does it. All the Hampstead schools do it. The area. Really. New wow. End. Okay. Just, um, um, this, you know, the school of this tree. The school of this tree. I don't, but we'll find out. That that, that school this. And then there's the school. It's between houses. Okay. And then and then all there's this like between houses there is yeah. And you know there's in our neighbours. Yeah. In our on our road, Five Patterson Road, up there. This here's our house, and just go up up up, and just there. There's this. We got a neighbour. She's Russian, and she's in it. Your neighbour. How yes. do you know she's in it? Because we do, she comes to her to school. That her, because she got two sons. Yeah. One to just a tiny baby. It's Russian though. His name is Misha. Misha. Yes, and the other one is called. Um, What's Sasha. his real name? It's Sasha. So Alexander is it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. His re his real name is his Alexander. name is Sasha, but he, they call him Alexander. Well, Alexander's yes. his real name, yes, isn't yes. it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So then they. 
that family they do they do it they have the, I don't know what the school is called but it's just you know Hams do you know Tesco next to this parish church yes yes there's Tesco and then just like when you go there there's this this just this but just this uh, station yeah. and you just go down and down and then you can see the post office there and you go straight down and it's on the right you can see this little road and then you okay. go there and after there there and after there's the school you know the school between yeah. there yes okay. that school that's where they go that's the right. school paedophile school paedophile school mm -hmm. okay well we'll, do, we'll have a little break it's all right i mean me and Claire just have a quick chat to see if there's anything else we're going to cover because I know it's late and I don't want you getting too tired because it's been a long day for I'm you. I'm not really tired anyway. Really? Like, You've I'm, done very I'm, well. I'm full of food in my tummy. Yeah, what did you have? I had. I went to the Indian cafe. Oh, did you? Yes, what you I have? had some mosa, had rice, I had some salad. Yeah. I had some rice, it's like rice bread yeah. with so, like mango chutney. Oh right. Yes, yeah, so oh, I had nice. that, but I'm just so full. I, I had, bet it sounds. I, I had I had this this enormous plate like that. Okay, okay. We'll just have a couple of minutes. You just wait here for us. Is that alright? because I think it sounds like you've got loads and loads to tell us doesn't it yeah um, I think it best if maybe we talk a couple of different times because I, I want to try and remember because you told me so much already tomorrow well maybe. what I'll do I'll speak to your mum and see what she thinks is best because obviously she, mum's no best don't they yeah so yeah. we'll ask her and we'll speak to her about what she thinks is best and where we'll go from there okay and then I'll, we'll sort of decide a plan of action. What I might ask to do is if I showed you on a computer what we think is your dad's house. Yes. Can you tell me yes or no if it's your dad's yes, house? Yes, if you think that's my dad's house. We've could, got one where we think it, we've got yeah. to show our dad's house. Yes. And then you tell us yes it is or no it yes, isn't. Yes, yes. Can we do right. that? Yes. Yeah, we'll do that then. So if you want. Okay yeah. then, we'll, we'll do. We'll call it to a close and it's 23, 24. Because it's really late. So what I'll do... I do. All I all I speak to, well, I do speak to adults sometimes, but most of the time I speak to children. Because they're, they're, they're involved. Gone. What do you mean? Like, so like that they know what to, everything is, but the parents they don't know everything. Maybe the children didn't say maybe something. Maybe there's one thing that children didn't say to the apt parent. Yeah, that's that's sometimes why, and sometimes we talk. The reason we talk about it sometimes because say um, you're embarrassed or scared to tell your mum. then one thing. Yeah, so if she's here and you think, oh, I don't want my mum to know or I'm scared for her to know, she won't know because she won't be here, will she? So then we can discuss it about whether we need to tell them or how we're going to tell them it, if that's what you want. So it's a chance for you to talk about things without them there really so that's what it is and also sometimes you want to tell me something and you don't want to upset your mum so it's easier that's so that's what that's one of the reasons why they're not here and that's so that's right yeah the other chap who I, who I pointed out can you remember his name no Carl his name is Carl uh, Carl Carl K-A-R-L Carl. Carl Carl yeah Carl well, okay. Carl yeah, yeah. Carl it seems like we're on R. Yeah, it's, I think it's my accent rather than uh, I think you said it right and I Carl. said it Carl, yeah. He, 
He's the controller for this interview, and his yeah, job. So he's on a computer. Exactly, watching what we're we're doing and listening to what we're saying. Yeah, it's okay. because you've got the speakers this time. That's exactly right. That's exactly right. And today's date is the it's the eleventh of September, and it's eighteen fifteen, which means it's quarter past six in the evening. Okay. And before we um, go on, I just wonder if you can tell us your full name and your date of birth. I don't understand. What's your, what's your first name? Elisa. Elisa. Then your middle name was Grace, is yes. that right? And then you've got a surname, haven't Graver you? Graver Graver Dearman. Graver Dearman. And when was you born? Uh, 2005. Yeah. Uh, April, tw uh, April 24th. April 24th, 2005. Okay, and when we're talking, there's going to be some rules, and I know we discussed them when we went to Barnet. Yeah. But I just want to just check your memory, just to make sure they're okay, and I'll do that just by repeating them, and just discussing about truth and lies. Okay. Um, first of all, I wasn't there, so I need you to explain as much detail, everything that you can. Yeah. Okay. All about what's happening, like all what my father's doing to us. Yes, or whatever it is that you need to tell me. Okay. Um, if there's a, um, if there's something that you that you don't understand that I ask you, just let me know. Okay. And um, I don't want you to guess anything that we talk about. So if you don't know the answer, just tell me. Okay. If you don't understand anything, you let me know, right? And that's because everything we talked about must be the truth, okay? And we discussed it. Do you remember we did a little example, didn't we? Do you remember what it was? No. About truth and lies? I don't remember. Okay, when with the paper and asked if I was telling the truth or a lie, do you remember? I. I think, yeah, 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 you draw this, uh, this uh, smiley face. Yeah. And after you, like, if you said that you asked Cleo who drew that. Yeah. And, no, if she asked you who yeah. drawn that and you said that you don't know, yeah. that is a lie. And if she asked you who drew that and you said it was me, I draw that story. And yeah. then that's, so that, and that's that the truth. Yeah. So, again, here, we need to tell the truth, okay? And can't sort of say that enough really that it's got to be the truth so just remind me I know you gave a very good reason for why people lie sometimes before what, um, can you tell me what that is why do sometimes people lie mm, maybe they don't want you to know maybe you don't, they don't want you to know about that maybe I think yeah. like they maybe lie I don't know though so they don't want you to know some maybe. So they might don't they don't want you to know anything that like yeah. they don't want you to know a, a thing about them or something. Yeah. So if a person asks like, what did you do today or whatever, yeah. and then they say I just stayed at home doing, yeah. I just in I just stayed at home sleeping, but actually went out, yeah. or doing I don't know I don't know. Okay. Um, well, I just have a quick check just so it's because I spoke to your brother before you, and he he went out of break, and he was waiting in the other room as well, and um, he was watching the telly. So that's why it's still on that children's channel, I think, because mm. he was watching it before you. Um, he mentioned sometimes you watch telly at the tennis club as well. Yeah. Yeah, is that yes, right? Yes. What what telly do they have at the tennis club? Samsung. A Samsung telly. Yeah. Okay. Um, what. What I'd like to talk about today is just, I know we spoke a bit about your school and some of the rooms in the school and the church as well. Yes. What I'd like to do today is just talk a bit more about the church, if that's okay. Yeah. And ask you what you can tell me about this church. Yes, and we, d we dance in the church with, well, with the baby skulls on. Do you? Yes. So where is this church? It's just like, our school is just tin and there's just this little path you go out of like this is little p so here's the school and here's the exit door yeah. and then there's just a little path and then there, here's the parking space 
And then next to the parking space, there's this big church. Okay. Yeah, that's where it is. Okay, so when you get into the church, tell me what it looks like. Well, there's a little, like, little pathway inside the church, so you have to go, like, you go in the church, and then you go up the stairs again, and you go, and then there's this little path again, and then you go up the stairs, and there's another path going into the church, and then yeah. there's this big hall with the seats, there's, yeah. like, the church rows, yeah. well, the, where the seats are, all yeah. in rows, and after this, this big, like, carpet, like it's not it's like a, like two little like little stairs and yes. big space yeah at the front and then that's where they dance with the skulls on okay where do they dance on that like car kind of carpet yeah. floor okay okay and so how do they do is there nothing there on this carpet floor no really there's just this little table it's not it's not actually little, it's a table with two big candles on. Okay. And is there, is it, is that the whole of the church? Are there any other rooms or anything like yeah, that? Yeah, there's a nursery na inside the church. There's a nursery. Oh, is there? There's yes. a nursery? Yes, oh, yes. Okay. There's and a nursery anything else? at the end. Yes, um, so there's, there's a nursery and there's this little room. There's a little room in the church, though. Okay, so what's in that little room? Yes, they have. They have the. They keep the skulls there. Okay. Yes, but it's not like so secret. But still, you. They got the keys to the church because okay. they're like Mrs. Forstow, the headmistress. She's in charge of the whole church. Right. And Father Paul is okay. the priest. Okay. So you go into the church, and you say there's all the chairs. Yes. You walk down. Yes. There's a couple of steps, which carpet but not carpet. Yes. And then there's a table on yes. the top. And that's where they dance. Yes, they're you not say, not on the table, but the the rest is all big space. Okay, and well, then you said there's a room that keeps some skulls in. Yes. And there's a nursery. And then they keep they keep yes, there's a nursery too. What's there's the nursery? Some, Do you call the nursery anything else? No, I don't know, but we just call it a nursery really. Okay, so you go into the nursery. Yes. And what's in the nursery? So in the nursery says there's just we do ace. So ace is kind of a club. Yeah. Where, where you act, yeah. sing, or dance, or kind of, like that kind of club yeah. in this nursery. Yes, but then sometimes the nursery does not work. Right. Sometimes, you know, maybe like one day it doesn't work and then the okay. other day doesn't. Okay. It does work. But there's a like a little spare room there. With, so it's a small room. A small room is just like where the the, the seats, well not the seats, the wooden seats. Should we draw it? Would that be easier for you, yes. do you think? Okay, so we draw it? Do you so want me to move to the table? Are you right sitting like yeah, that? So yeah, so you sure? So, so it's like... So we'll draw you, the church. So when you walk in here, right. it's just this like seats here. Yeah. All, all at the back here, and then there's this little path. Yeah. Where you walk through. Lovely. And then after, just on the side here, all around here, that's where like all 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 the side is all nursery. When you come in, there's this big room where you where we do the club. What? The, the club. Oh, Ace. Yes. So yes. where's Ace? Though? Ace is just here in a big big house. It's like a big room. There. And how do you get into that room? Yes, it's a big just a big door. You okay. just go in. Okay. You have to, you've got a lock. Okay, so you go into this room. Yes. And what's in this room? Yeah, in this room, it's not. It does not have skulls in or anything like this. No, what's in there then? But it's just. It's just like. It's a nursery room in there. Right. So you go in the nursery yes. room. Yes. So right, should we draw the nursery then, shall we? Yeah. So, so there's a nursery. So it's just like tables, and then here's. The, well, that's where they wash their hands. Here's the pegs where yeah. the cloak room. Yeah. And then after it's just this like this big space all around. Okay. Where, and then there's a little door going into the toy room. So where oh, okay. all the toys are kept. Okay. For the oh, children to play. What's in the toys room? Yeah, so it's just like it's just toys around there, but then after there's they got they keep cupboards. But then the headmistress, she tells the nursery oops, so that to the nursery that, that those cupboards that if they can keep them, but like not look into them, or like use them. And they're anything. in the toy room. Yes. Okay. And then after. What's in those cupboards? In those cupboards, they got the like the big white white bowl where they put where the oh, blood okay. drips in. Okay. Yes, and then they got the night the you know cleaver, the, this big yeah. Chinese one that's like that big knife. Yeah. 
Yeah, they keep that to cut the baby side off too. Okay. And then like, so you know where the church room is? Just there, this is another nursery room, but they barely use it. They never go in there. Okay, is there There's, anything in there? Yes. What? It's like a little room. It's like as big as this room. There's another door going into a kitchen. Okay. Yes, they, they keep it like a nursery kitchen, but they don't use it. So through that door, there's a nursery, there's a kit, there's a room. Yes, it's an old like, nursery yes. and a kitchen. Yes, but there's they don't a, use it. Yes, there's a door, just like just. This is like how big it is. Yeah. It seemed like that big, and then there's just here. There's this little door, and you not little. It's a door, a normal yeah. sized door. And when you go in, there's this a big kitchen, and then and then you've okay. got just a big silver fridge. Okay. But they keep like leftover of the baby meat there. Oh, okay. Yes, and they. And they keep the white bowl. Sometimes if there's any blood left over, right. so because some my dad, whenever he he's not he, like he, my dad he eats maybe like sometimes he eats two times a day like baby two times a day. Baby two. Okay. Yeah, sometimes like that if he if he feels like eating more baby. Okay. Because we have one big piece so, of that big piece of baby every every day. Right. Okay. Um. So let me just get straight. So you go into the into the uh, church yes then describe this some stairs carpet area with the yes. table here's then the carpet then area it's all around there but it's like much bigger space all around here okay then there's one room this is a nursery with a kitchen yes. in it which you can do you get do you get into it from this room do you yes yes so okay. the, it's just here where the seats are and then there's the big, okay. big, the big carpet okay. just next to that it's just okay. that so then there's that room, and you say you don't really use that room. No, they don't use it really. For they, anything? No. No. They barely use it. They just they just use it really like if the ch if the nursery child if the the child yeah. doesn't have didn't bring it the the pack lunch in. Oh, okay. They sometimes uh, have like okay. food that which they give like porridge or something like okay. that. Okay, so in the other room yes. is the nursery which they use. Yes. And then, then you go into a toy room. Yes, it's just like. And there's some cupboards where they keep a bowl and a cleaver. Yes. Are there any door, other doors or anything in this toy room? No, but there's another room when you go in church. So, like, I'll draw. Can I use the other paper? You, to draw you like use one? what you wish. Because this. So, when you go in the church, it's like, here's the. You're outside. Yeah. And then there's this little gate. Yeah. And there's a little passageway just here, and then that's another the entrance to the church. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so then you go straight and to the stair, then like that, and then the stairs just here. Yeah. Going up, and then after you go that way, and after there's an, there's like maybe like two stairs there, and then after there's this an other door just here. Right. And then after there's the there? hallway going into the church, all around the church is just that. So this is like, this is like where the whole church part is. Then there's this other room here. Yeah. All like this is like the entrance. Right. And then after there's this other room where the priest does he he's some he's some he's like his his like his things are in there. Right. Yes, but then after where the the big part carpet how do you know is, that? because we go there, we do sex what? there. Oh okay. Yes. Yeah, so then where this big carpet space. There's another door leading into the two. Right. Okay. So, um, so you're outside here, are yes. you? Yes. So you're outside. Yes. Um, you, you know where the cars park, like behind each yes, other. Yes. Yes. Where's that? Is that hit this side or no, is that somewhere this, else? It's this side. So it's the other side of the church. This yes. is the side by the road, is it? Yes. Right. Okay. So this is the side by the road. So you go along, and there's a door. Yes. This, is so this, this is door? like a gate outside. The gate outside here. Okay. It's so still outside this part. And this door goes inside the church, right. and then you go, it gets a little path, as I said. Okay. Then you does this path, goes, so then you have to go straight to, okay. the, to the right. And then after, where, when you go to the right, just at the front of you, yeah. there's this, like, maybe, as I said, maybe like four stairs, or four okay. small steps up. And then, then after you have, and then after when, like, you're up here, and then after you got, go straight, like, so like, when you go on the stairs here, so yeah. up, you're up here, like, this is the way, and after you have to, so it's just like, I didn't know, so, so you're up, you're up the stairs on this part here. Right, okay. 
Yes, and then after, so you're here, and then just there, there's this door going inside the church. And then after, there's this passageway, as I said, as I said, it's got this little passageway. So here, the passageway is all, around, all, all along here. And then after, but then you can, on the side, it's here, there's this door. Yeah. That's, that's, how it's, that's, that's how it is in the right. church. Right, okay, so this gate is at the side of the church, yes. not on the side where the cars are parked. No, no, no. The other side. And yes, on the other you side. You go through the gate, which is outside. Well, the school is just here. The school is just here. It's just a little, like a little path. Yeah. Yes, the church is so just is it, So is it on that side where there's a little path? Is this yes. On the, this is on the path side? Yes. So okay. here's this, this is like the up bit and this is the down okay. bit. So, so the path the is here between the church and the school, yeah? No, yes, like... No, no, no. So here's the entrance to the church, but it, like pretend this is the path. So the path is here. Yes, all along here. Okay. So the path's along here. Then you go through the gate. Yes. Then into the church. So you've got the church, keys. You've got a big through door. some stairs and that. And then there's a room where yes, yes, where, the where you do sex. Yes. Uses that. And there's this this table here, but yeah. small a small table. It got yeah. and then they got like little pegs for yeah. the for the things that the priest got. Yeah. And then they got kind of like cupboards along down, and they got the secret things. But they got like like a big like a lock because Mr. Morris, the caretaker. Yeah. And my father and Mr. Hollings and the priest, yeah. and Mrs. Forster, they all share, like, they got a big, so it's like a big, they got this big, uh, like, metal ring, and they've got a loads of keys on, loads, all like. Where the, do they keep these keys? In their pockets, because Mr. Morris, they got, he got enormous pockets. That's how you. Yes, he got enormous jeans, he got big jeans. And he got like he wears jeans. Mm. He's a tall, big guy. He looks strong, and he got like like those like the pockets like size of this, okay. like to your knee. And he kept he keeps it there. But he like like the, he's a caretaker. Yeah. So he closes he closes the school. He got the keys to the ro rooms in the school. Like right. like all like like that. He got the keys to the church. All the all the property they got. Okay. So like. Everything they own, so they own a school, mm. they own a church because it's our church. Okay. Yes, they keep the church. Right. So, these secret things—they're kept in the room where the priest keeps his things. Is that yeah. right? Yes, because the priest. And whereabouts in his room do they keep these secret? Just like things? right at the back, but it's just—it looks like it's just like here's the door, yeah. and it's, it's far back. It's just I don't have enough space. Yeah. Okay, I mean, what like, does it look like, this thing they keep the secret? So it just thing looks thing. like really like patterned, patterned like, imagine this, well it's not as big as this room, but it's like imagine there's this big, like big cupboard here, yeah. and it's just like, it's, it looks like a wardrobe, they've got loads of like wooden mm -hmm. patterns on. And what is kept in there? Yes, they keep, they've got a big key lock there, yeah. so then they unlock, they unlock with the, yeah. the key, the lock, the lock, yeah. and they open up the the wardrobe, and then after, as I said, so special things they got. So, because the priest, the priest, he got a car, anyway. Right. So, like, so what secret things they keep in there? Yes. Yeah, so oh. he keeps more, like precious things, like maybe car keys, maybe it's like, okay. and then he some they keep the skulls there because they were like twenty. The adults, okay, so some like the skulls parents, there. they all because the parents. The parents of the children, they keep their own skulls in their own house because they dance in their own house. Okay. Yes, but then, so like Vanessa, she's a parent, she keeps her own skulls. But like the okay. teachers and my father's, my father's skull are kept in there because they wear 20 spe they, they wear twenty skulls each and there's 20 special children. Okay. So Millie and the others. Yeah. Okay, so I just want to make sure I've got the description of this whole church right yes just tell me if I'm wrong okay just stop if I yes. get something wrong stop me you've got the main entrance yes you go in and in that big room yes rows of chairs yes and then there's a pathway in the middle yes. where you can walk up and down yes and there's a larger area up some stairs which is carpeted yes you've got a table on yes and that's where they do the dancing yes. with the skulls yes yes then, right about yes then there's two nurseries one's not yes. used very much yes and it's got a kitchen 
with a silver fridge. Yes. And sometimes they make porridge for the children there. Yes, but they do they like, keep, but they keep the porridge into the like, cupboards well with food like honey or whatever they use for the porridge. Okay. Or maybe like jam because they sometimes make toast for the children. They don't like they don't use the fridge really, it's just porridge. It's just okay. like and then they keep bits of baby, yes, left over yes. baby, left yes, over Yes, but they, they don't let the, the headmistress, they, do, they make sure that they do not let the nursery use, like, they've used the fridge. They're not allowed to use yes, the fridge. Yes, yes, they're not allowed. And how can they not get in the fridge? Why can't no, the nursery just open one, it? Because one is that the headmistress, yeah. she's still the head, head of the church. Yeah, so she's say like, say like one of the nurseries thought, bought a yoghurt in because they were hungry for lunch and they thought oh, actually I'll just put it in the fridge. Why couldn't they just put it in the no, fridge? No, they're, they're not allowed. Not but allowed. Not say allowed. there's a... But they're in the room, like the staff room of the nursery, yeah. so, or the nursery room, they said the back there's the store and it's the X of the nursery. Yeah. To the other side and then there's just the toilet for the nursery and instead there's this room where the, like, the people who work in the nursery, that's where they're all rest. They've got their own fridge there. Okay, so there's a little room off the nursery. Yes, they already got okay. their own fridge. So you go into the nursery. Yes. You said there's a little tiny room off it that's for where they can yeah, rest. Yeah, an office of the nursery. There's an office in the nursery where yes. they can rest. And also there's a toy room. Yes, yeah. a toy room like right at the back of the... Like, back of the you go in the toy room, then there's a cupboard. Yes. Are there any other doors? No, there's no, no doors really, it's just like, just cupboards are there, and then all on the sides is just packet of toys everywhere. So you definitely can't get in, yes. if you go into, yes. you can only go back into the nursery, you can't go anywhere yes, it's else. Just, it's just like, just cupboards there, and it's just got toys everywhere around you. So you definitely can't yes. go anywhere else other yes, than the nursery. but they've got this little big okay. box of like, broken toys in. Okay. But they don't keep, like, they don't, like, they make sure. Like because they make sure that they okay. can't, they make sure like the headmistress, she's still the head of the nursery. Yeah. Because the nursery, they are like the the part of the church. Okay. Headmistress do not let the the like she's the head of the nursery anyway. Okay. So she she does not let the nursery the nursery teachers, well nursery at the staff, mm. they do not like she gives them like thing like rules like. Mm. Do not do not go in the cupboards. Do not go to the fridge or anything. But then, but because they because of Mrs. Forsyke, she doesn't really trust the nursery. She got her own locks on the cupboards anyway. She okay. does not really trust them. Okay. Just in case, like just in case if they do, do like they do go like come in and like just like open the cupboard. Okay. All right. That's very good. Thank you. Thanks. It's a very good description given me there, thank you. Um, so, did you want to sit down? Are you comfortable there or would you rather sit back on the mind. sofa? You sit, where you, you sit wherever you're comfortable, it's up to you. But the speaker still can hear. Yeah, I'm just, what it is, if you can't, if Carl can't hear us, he would have come and knocked on that door to say, and that, oh. that when I hear a knock on that door, I know Carl wants me to speak Be up. Be able speak yeah, loud. He's, right. Yeah, so, rather yes. than interrupt us. Yes, okay? yes. Okay, so we've spoken about that the church. Um, oops, do you mind if I just quickly check the time? Okay, so just, um, there's a, what do I ask a quick couple of questions and then you can have a little break. Is that all right? Yes. Okay, so um, who is it you live with at home at the moment? My mum. My mum and Abraham. Your mum, Abraham. Anyone else? No. But my nanny, Galia, she comes. Galia. Yes. And that's short for something, isn't it, Galia? No, her real name is Galina. Galina, yeah, and Galia's short, is Yes, it? Yeah. because she's Russian and Ukrainish. Yeah. yeah. And then your mum and Abraham. Yes, the, the, we live with them. And what do you call Abraham? Do you always call him Abraham or do you call him No, Abraham? we don't call him Abraham, we call him Papa Hemp. Papa Hemp. So Papa Hemp, Mama yes. and Galia. Yes. Okay. But she, Galia does not live with us. No? Where does she no. live? She she lives, I don't know where she lives, she never took us to her house. Yeah. But but she, I don't know where she lives, but she comes to our house to work, to make, look after us when my eight, when no uh, Papa and her mum are like out tonight, okay. or anything like that. Okay. So tell me about, tell me about Mama first of all, what's she like? She's kind, we ask her for food mostly. Yeah. But 
But we so we sometimes nag her for food though. Yeah. But we don't all we don't always. But it, but Abraham, but why um, is that? Why do you nag for food? Because we we love eating, but sometimes she she says like maybe she get makes us a soup or something. Yeah. But we we don't really want soup. We like sweet stuff. Yeah. So that's why we ask her for fruit, like bananas, because we've got like loads of baskets yeah. of bananas in our house. What do you? What's your favourite soup? Well, they do make that kind of soup like chicken soup or anything like no. that. No, what do you mean? They make like, you know hemp? I know hemp, it's like a root of, of a plant. Yes, you know the weed which you smoke? Yes. Yes, but that's, its real name is hemp. Okay. But like fresh hemp. Yes, that's what we make like soup out. We have a juicer and we make, we juice the soup. Right, so you, we don't have like pieces in or anything like that. So you don't have like vegetables? No, no. We don't have like normal soup or either. Mushroom soup. No. Mm -mm. We used to, but now we don't. But when we used to go to school, they used to give us like red rice, wild red rice. They used okay. to give us that and buckwheat and that kind of stuff. Okay. I've got a question. How do you know about weed? How did you know that you smoke weed? Abraham. Uh, um, Abraham told me about that. What did he tell you about it? He said that like we you're not supposed to like the first time we met him. Yeah. We so he told my mum about hemp. What did he say? And uh, he said that you don't smoke weed, even though my mum did not smoke it, but she didn't know what weed was anyway. So he told her that you have to eat it fresh, not dry or anything. So then or like that kind of stuff. So like. So, because he's a nutritionist, he says. Okay. So, he, so he because we used to eat it. So, where do you buy that from then? Oh, we we I don't know, but they we went to holiday to Morocco. Yeah. For holiday, but. No, I mean to get soup. How do you? Where do you buy the hemp to buy to make soup? Yeah, they got that. It's delivered to us. Oh right, okay. Yes, but then most of it is bad. Okay. And we got loads of buckets of hemp seeds. Like whole hemp seeds, yeah. not like, not the ones in shops and those little plastic bags with, like who are like, like yeah. soft ones. Okay, so why do you need the seeds? To juice them. You juice the seeds because we get the milk from it and we make juices. Oh, I see. I see. I we understand. make green juices, that kind of stuff. I understand. Well, my mum used to make us like like soup, which is that it got cabbage, but like red is it's like a, a soup. Bush. Yes, it's like. It's like it got like beetroot pieces, yeah. but it's like boiled. Yeah. It's not fresh. No, no. But no. it's like it's like red cabbage. You've got a bit of red yeah. cabbage, because she, we used to buy the veggie sausages. Yeah. So like, it made out of soya. Yeah. Not like real pork ones. Okay. So mama's nice, but sometimes yes. you never go for food. Yes. And um, what's your favourite thing about mama? She's really kind and she looks after us. So she takes us to holidays. Sometimes she gives us junk food. Yeah. So maybe sometimes she gets like a really like a sugar like a really sugary smoothie. Because okay. when we used to go to holidays to Gran Canaria, did she used to buy us like in it, there's a place called Torito. Yes, and then she buy us this, this fruit. I there's this fruit smoothies. So it's just like fruit in little packets, all kind of flavors, but it's like frozen fruit and then they make smoothies out of them. Okay. And is there anything that you don't like? Well really I do I used to really I don't know. But I used to do not I used to not like um what is it? Uh, she, my mum used to make sushi. But yeah. without no, I mean rice. about what your mum does, is there anything that your mum does that you don't like? Mm. Other than food? Mm. Well I meditate. Do you? Yes, do I you meditate. Like that? Yes, I meditate. But really, my mum got upset about one thing about meditation. Why? Because I because she did not know that we eat, I ate meat or baby meat all this time oh, since okay. I was a baby. She never knew. Okay. But then when I started to meditate when I was six years old, but now I'm nine. I was meditating for three years now. Yeah. So but okay. now but but when I when she found out about I eat baby. 
Yeah. She well, because that's why I keep on telling her. I, when I she did not know. That's why I keep on telling her. I don't want to meditate. I don't. Okay. Uh, it's really boring because I knew while I'm meditating, even because one of the rules is not to eat meat or any dairy. Right, I see. Or lie or steal or do anything. Okay. But then I, but because that time, my dad used to learn me to steal money, all kind of stuff like that. That's why I used to steal my mum's money and buy sweets with it, or okay. sometimes give it to my dad. Okay, and what about Papa Hemp? Yes. What's he like? He's kind, but when I, but when he, when we were telling him all about this yeah. on the holidays in Morocco, yeah, we because we we, we were scared to tell, of yeah. course. So we lied a bit, we lied a lot though. Okay. We lied a lot, but then we were so scared and terrified when they, when he found out about it. Because if the fir first time he's like, right, Elisa and Gabriel, somebody's touching you, and I know it's what, who it is. He said and that to I you. Said, and then we just gave up and we just said, my dad. What do you mean you gave so up? We, we, so we like, we gave up the, like, we gave up the deal with our dad to not to tell anyone about this or okay. mom anyone okay. but then we just gave up the deal we just told him there's our dad and then we carry on okay. telling but that time we were terrified to tell all about this okay. baby steal a baby killing and all this yeah. so then after what so we lied a lot as we as i said yeah. because we were terrified okay. and we were still so but he he gave us he her he didn't hurt us but he got spoons and gave us not hard hard licks yeah. just gave us the soft licks. Who did? Uh, Abraham. Especially you licks. so that we could tell because we were used to hurting. What do you mean he hit you and gave you licks? No 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 like that we call them licks. Oh what does that mean? So it's like a spoon hit, but it's like so it's just a soft hit one. You. Why did he hit you? So that because we keep on lying, we keep on lying, but then our, because we, we told him that the only way that we could we could tell you is by him hurting us. You told him that? Yes. Or he said that? No, no, he did, we didn't tell him, but he knew that because we told him that if we like, if we misbehave or like, like make a noise with our dad, he'll give us licks. Yeah. But then after, Abraham thought it would be a yeah. good idea if he could give us like soft ones just like that. What did he use to do that? A spoon. Okay, what sort of spoon? It's just a normal cutlery one, which like okay. people eat with in restaurants or anything. Okay. He didn't hit us so hard. Well, what it's did just your soft, mum say soft. about that? Nothing, nothing. No, nothing. She thought it was a good idea. Because then after, when he had licks, and we have water torture, which is we call so. it a water torture. So he gets loads of jugs of warm water, yeah. spills it on us. So then after he's like, he says that he's blessing us so that we can tell. Who's that? Abraham. Right. Yes. So then after he gives us that, then after we we like because after we, we're used to her. What's your mum saying? When this is going nothing. On? Nothing. She doesn't. She doesn't mind. She thinks it's a good idea to do that so that we can tell. Okay. No, because we were we were used to hitting. Okay. Whenever he gave us licks, the first time he wanted to try it yeah. out, he gave us a lick. Yeah. Uh, do you know this? Yeah. This would this thing is like he he did do it on purpose, but then after he accidentally hit me just here with what? With the spoon. He accidentally, it was really sharp. The spoon. He okay. had accidentally done this to me with the spoon. Right. Okay. I I forgave him. I didn't I didn't okay. mind, but like. He realised that we did not, me and Gabriel do not care if we get hit. Okay. Because um, my dad used to hit us all the time, every single day. Okay. What we'll do, I think um, we'll have a little break because you've been speaking for a long time. I'm just going to see how your mum's getting on. And Matt, okay? Alright, do you want to come with me? You can wait in the room and watch a little bit of telly I'll, for five minutes. I'll just eat some strawberries on Yeah, just take oh, them. Oh, don't worry, we'll tidy it up. Don't oh. worry.
you have a sit down. What I'd like to just talk about is, um, so you was in Morocco. Yes. So um, how did, uh, what happened with, first of all, with Abraham finding out? What did he find out? No, but one is he had a lot of clues. Why did he have a lot of clues? Once he saw yeah, go on, me tell. and Gabriel touch each other anyway. What were you doing touching each other? What do you mean? So touching each other in the privates. Okay, so what was you doing? It's because we've got secret secret con contact with, me, with me and Gabriel. So what were you and Gabriel doing? What did Abraham see you and Gabriel doing? Yes, we touched each other in the private. How? How were you touching him? So like we uh, were close together and then we, we pinched each other bottom and then we we touched each other front private. Oh, okay. And how did you touch his front private? So that he could like go like that because that's my father. Oh, that's how my father. Okay. So you were touching each other. Yes. Abraham seen. Yes. And you said first of all you didn't tell him anything. Yes, but but, it, but one is that he heard my father's voice too, oh. and then he he said it first time when he heard his father my father's voice. Yeah. Something was wrong with it. Yeah. And then you said that um, he helped you. He helped you tell the truth. Yes. So, and there were two ways he helped you tell the truth. Yes. The first way you said about a spoon. The second one was water. Yeah, yes, but water torture. And the other one is that he explained us that killing babies was wrong. Yeah. And all this kind okay, of stuff. Okay, so three things. So yes. telling you it's wrong, water. Torture. Well, explaining us that okay. everything what he does is Tell, bad. What is water torture? I don't understand it. So, like, he gets big jugs of yeah. warm water. Warm water, yeah. And then he tells us to stay on our knees. Stay on your knees. And then he he just he just drops the water on us. Right. So, like, he pours the water on us in one whole go like that. Yeah. So he pours the whole water. It's warm water. And how does that warm water feel? Well, it's it's when you pour it on, it's cold. Right. But so actually, it's warm. warm. Okay, okay, and and then you said he hits you with a spoon. He gives you licks. Yes, but not hard, not hard. Not hard, but he, and he calls that. Yes, he but well, he was like saying he was telling me to tell because he was pushing the spoon into my chin. He's pushing it into. His, what yes. do you mean pushing it into? So your chin? he got like the spoon, like pretend this is a spoon. He was like pushing it in my chin. Oh, okay. Like, Lifting my chin up, so doing like that, saying, so telling me to tell okay. the truth. And where was your mum when this happened? In the in the bedroom in the, in the hotel. Did she know it was happening? Yes. Oh, okay. Why wasn't she in the same room then? She was in the room. Okay, so just a bedroom in the. Yes, yeah, so she was lying in yeah. a bed, okay. and he was standing up next to the bed, okay. and I was in a corner, but like where the bed was, okay. my mum was. And what about um, your brother Gabriel? How did they help him? How was he helped to tell the licks. truth? He ha he. Well, it seems like he hates licks. Yeah. Who but does? Uh, Gabriel, but he actually likes them. He, he seems. What? How does it seem? So like he, he. So he screams. He does all kind of stuff. Like it. Like says it hurts. But actually, it doesn't matter. He. It doesn't actually hurt. Has he ever hit you in England or just in? We had Morocco. a lot of fights, worse than a cat and a dog. Who? Me and Gabriel. No, I mean, you, Abraham, has he ever given you licks in England or just in Morocco? No, only in Morocco. That's the only okay. time when he ever done it to me. Okay. Um, okay. And what about to Gabriel? Uh, Gabriel, the same, yes. Okay. But he, 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 as I said, me and Gabriel, my father learned to me and Gabriel, well, taught to me and Gabriel, both to fight with each other, but like worse than a cat and a dog. Okay. So I like, grip each other on the hand and like scratch them and then yeah. pull each other's hair and all kind of stuff. Okay. And then pull my hand, bang me on the floor, and, and then do that kind of bad stuff. Perfect. And then once my father taught me, like he did taught me, but he told me to take to make my father, well my brother's head bleed, or like like maybe like so like my brother's head bleed. So that it actually ble uh, bleed. Yeah. So I said, "How should I do that?" And then, uh, but I didn't want to do that anyway. I wasn't and going to. I wanted to know. Yes, okay. I wanted to know. Like I want, well, Ricky Deer Man. Yeah. I wanted to know, like, how did how I wanted to know how 
will he tell me to do that? But I wasn't actually doing, going to do that. But then when after, when I, when he, because after I wasn't like, he said, are you sure you can do that? I said, I would have said, yes, of course I'm sure. But I didn't do like, like he wasn't sure with me. Yeah. Like if I will do it. So then after he gave me licks, like hard, hard ones. I can make your Who head did? bleed. My, uh, my, my Mickey father. Demon. Yes. Okay. Yes. Um. So he gave me licks, licks, till I will say it, like say like say that I will do it, uh, Papa. I will do it for sure. I promise you. And then after, so, so if I say I promise him that I will do it, that I have to, I'll have to do it. Okay. So then after I done it, so he told me like, do I have any frame, sort of glass frame or anything? Yeah of a picture in it but it got glass on the at front. I said, Well, I think I do. It's a it's it's, it's like I I told him I think I do have one. It's a picture of Supreme Master Ching Hai. Yeah. So it's like that's the that's the person that we pray for and meditate for. Right. Yeah, so there was a picture of her and after it, I said, I think it got glass frame because I saw my mum uh, putting apart the photo and putting it in or like taking it out and then changing the frame yeah. but then after when I saw her putting in the new frame yeah. the photo like of the picture of her yeah. it, she they put like the, this glass at the yeah. top I thought it was plastic first but then after when I asked mum when she was putting it in I just I I just felt it with my nails I went I just I just were like yeah. softly knock like some yeah. like um, yeah. with my nails touched it with my nails but like like, um, how to say, like, just pass it. You glass. Yes, yeah. yes, so then I'll just said, I know how to tell it's glass because it'll like, make a little yeah. tiny noise. Yeah. But it wasn't plastic then. And now I made sure that it was glass, so I asked mum, my mum, if it was glass. She said, yes, it's glass, be careful. Yeah. But then after, I, because after, he told us to have a big fight, like, as, as big as they can. But then after that time, well, we were, I was so angry then. And how did he tell you that? So he told me, like, like, like to fight. He learnt, he taught us to fight okay. really badly. Okay. And then after, for once, we fought, me and Gabriel fighted so badly. Okay. So, like, once, he, because my father lived with us then, yeah. he told me to, uh, he, so he, he did tell me, but then after he told me to think of a really bad thing to do. So then I thought, and I just gave an example for my dad, yeah. and then I wanted him to be pleased with me, not to give me any, like, any licks or anything. So then after I said, uh, because we got a, so we had, used to have a baby bed, so a little, so you know babies which sleep in this little yeah. beds, but not the one that rock, yeah. that you have to rock. There's a still bed, it's like maybe a five or four year old can sleep yeah. in it. So now after it, but it had a gate in it, so you can just capture, you can just put like maybe a suitcase under the bed, but then you can't take it out just like that. Because the, because it got like, it looks like gates at the, to at the front. Yeah. So then I, I gave Gabriel a trick. So I told my dad that I, I, I told him what I think to do. So I said, I will, I will, I'll trick Gabriel by getting him under the under the baby bed and lock him in there and 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 stay on the bed so that he can't come out. So he can't yeah. like because the he the bed was a bit yeah. well, was a bit light. So then because he can yeah. pick up the bed. So then after he tried to pick up the bed, he couldn't because I was heavy there and I was still on the bed. So then he was screaming, screaming. And then after when I heard, like maybe left him there for three minutes on. Yeah. I run right in, like, my mum does yoga, yeah. so then I run in the yoga room where she does it, I heard, I hid in the cupboards, yeah. but I thought they would never find me there, so then I, he I went there, and then I hid, I, I hid there, yeah. and then Gabriel knew that place, I thought he didn't, but then he opened it, and then he teared my hair off, and Gabriel he got, is. yes, he got my hair, bang me everywhere on the walls the moment on the floor I got so angry so then after I but I started it okay. so then after I got this frame and I made sure he did look so I was behind his back and then I went that on his head so then after the piece of glass went in his head and then he bled yes and then after but once he done something bad to me anyway
What? Well, it was on purpose actually. Oh, don't worry. Don't What we'll do? Um, I think we'll stop because your mum's finished and it's getting quite late for a day. So I think we're going to take a break if that's all, and we're going to stop and just we'll finish up for today. Is that all right? Yes. Um, I heard my mum said that we are going to go to mo see you tomorrow. I think you can, what it is, um, they just want to make sure you're okay at a hospital tomorrow. So they're going to check you over, make sure you're okay. And in a you're hospital? Not, yeah, in a hospital. To see. And a special one, though, like a child special It's one. a doctor that specially deals with children. And they're going to see if you're hurt or if you've got any injuries or anything like that. Do you, know, do you think you've got any injuries or hurt anywhere? No, no. I didn't see my father for a long time now. Okay. Nearly two months. Okay, then. But one is that... One is that our, the, our one is that once when I was only five or yeah. four, I rem I remember that uh, that my father got the spoon and then he hurted me all in here yeah. and after it like he cracked my head open. Okay. And what I remember is that I saw my my mum and my father fight with each other in the bathroom and my father nearly killed my mum by because he was strong then my mum yeah. was not strong okay. but he was handsome handsome yes uh, I can't I can't say it properly yeah. so then he yeah. because he banged her on the floor and then he got his knee and yeah. pushed her right in my mum's head oh dear. and he nearly killed her but then after she could she because my big brother James yeah. He was there, he was only a small boy, but he was old enough to have a phone. Yeah. He had his own phone, and my mum mom called for James to, to call the police. Yeah. But he'd done it straight away, and maybe in maybe 15 minutes, the police were there, quick. Yeah. And, but my father still did not leave the house. Okay. But then when the police came, my father left the house. Yeah. The police car was arrived in front of our house, and my father was just going out of the door. Yeah. Just going out. Then they arrested him and then done. Okay. I remembered that, but I was scared. Because okay. when the, he opened the door, he done it on purpose. He opened up the door because he wanted to take me and Gable to the party. Yeah. He told, asked my mum. He asked my mum. He was living with us, though. He was only little, so how do you remember that? I was only little. I was only, like, maybe three years old. But so I how remember. do you know that? Who, did someone no, tell remember. you about it? I remember. Oh really? I remember wow. when I was from there. three. Yes, wow. I remember. I remember. That's to the after. That's I good because not a lot of people can remember from three. I was next to the door, and uh, I was listening. I was I was looking. Uh, I was peeking through the door. What they were doing? And then the door that time it didn't go in the room in the bathroom. It went out of the bathroom into the corridor. So if it, you open it, you can hit somebody. But my father saw me picking, peeking. So he just opened the door straight away. So that it, it, the door bang right on my head. Yeah. And I I I got knocked over. I got hurted. Yeah. And mum and then he pretended that he did not hurt me or anything. But then after, but he pretended he pretended to be nice then. Yeah. But my mum, he just, she just, um, my big brother James, he just called the police straight away. Okay, all right. Um, what we'll do is we'll call it an end. It's 12 minutes past seven, and it's the 11th of September, okay? We'll do, if you go in the, com the room with the telly, then when your mum's finished, she'll come in and join you. Yeah. And I'll give this a clean up while... Yeah, I'll leave it, because I've got to come and clean that. Can you sit on this one for us, please? Because the speakers, this thing here, you see up here? Yeah. So this one speaking, I think there's another one, which is that one there. This one here. So there's another one there. Yeah, yeah, you're right. So there are a couple. The cameras are a little easier to spot in this one, aren't they, as well? One, two, three. Three. And Joe, why is three in this room? Uh, yeah. Right, the first one there, see the one down below? Yes. Um, it's on like a bigger box, do you see there? Yeah. And that's because that one can move about. And that's the camera for you, okay? Then there's another one, the same. It's on a box. That camera's for me. So one's looking at you, one looking at me. And then that one up there shows the whole room. So that's why this one has three, okay? Um, where we are today, we're, in, we're not in London today. We're at a place called Rowan House, which is in Suffolk. And today's date is the t it is the um, sorry it's not coming up, the 17th of September, and it's 10:31. Okay. 
Well, that's it. It's just, can you tell us your full name, can you? Alisa. Uh, Alisa is my real name. Yep. My middle name is Grace, and my surname is Grave Adino. Yes. And there are two other people here. My name's Steve, and I'm pleased. Well, we've met a few times now, haven't yeah. we? And we've done a couple of these interviews. So this is, do you remember how many we've done before? Three. No, this is number three. So we've done two. We've done one at Barnet, one in Wood Green, and then today. So this is number three. Oh. And then there's another chap. Can you remember his name? Carl. Carl, that's right, Carl. And this other one is Matt. And Sarah and we met Cleo yesterday. In oh, did you? Oh, you? So you met today's Carl. So Matt and Cleo, they work in my office and they work with me. Yeah, but I know by Matt. Cleo was at the hospital. Yesterday. Yeah. And yeah, she works with me, but she's not here today. It's only me and Carl. And what we're here today is just carry on really what we've been talking about because because it's been so and how much. How it all started. And well, we spoke a few bits, haven't we? And then. Whilst we was on our way here, we sit. Some of them are, some of them are not true. That Abraham told us to say. Yeah, that's what you said. You said. Yeah, on that's the right. Yeah. So what we do? That's where we'll start. But before we do, um, I'd like to just um, go through the rules again. I know you're probably sick of hearing. I don't Gosh, <laughs> can you remember them, Kenya? Don't lie, tell the truth. That is, yeah, that's a very, that is one of the rules. Don't lie and tell the truth. That is yeah. a rule. So the first rule, uh, tell me if you remember them or not, is that I wasn't there, so I need you to tell me everything you can. Do you remember that one? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. And then, if if you don't know the answer, what do you say? Dad, I don't know the answer. Yep, yeah, that's right. And if you don't understand, question I ask? I will, I'll tell you I don't understand. Perfect, yeah. And then that goes the other way as well. If I if I hear something you say that I don't understand, I might well, ask then, you. Yeah. And then there's the one that you said that we must tell the truth and that we can't lie. And I think we've already you've already shown me that you understand the difference a couple of times about yeah. the difference, okay? So we won't, I don't think we need to go there a third time really because I think <laughs> you, you've been very clear with what you said and what about rude words or things like that is it okay to use them in this room yes yes it is that's right okay and this pen and paper who's who's able to use this can you remember yeah. and who else uh, you can and it's for you really basically if you want to say you want to draw or write something yeah, I know what it is for. I know what it is. Yeah. So if there's it. something that I, I didn't tell you, but I don't, I don't want to tell you, but I can just write it down so the next time I can show you. If you want to, if you want to write it down, and it's easy for you to write it down, that's fine. It's fine. It's there mm -hmm. for whatever you think it's best to do. Like say, for, say you want to draw something, you can draw something. Okay. Uh, right. So what are we going to start off by saying? Well... Shall I, shall I remind you, we were talking a lot about food in the car. I think that was 99% yeah. of the Germany, wasn't it? Yes, the, all rubbish. <laughs> and there's one, one other thing you told me was about... Um, that it you watched, told us some things to tell that yeah. which is not true. Because you mentioned about Zorro and about heads being cut yeah. off, didn't you, yeah. in that film? Yeah. And obviously I wondered whether or not that... Because he watched it, so his film, he yeah. watched it, he blended it. Oh, us. okay. And I was wondering, is that, is that how you knew about the babies? Because yes, that's because I had an idea, so then I told Abraham, and then Abraham said, good, don't do that, and tell that to the police. Right, okay. So, what I want to start, I just want to start from the beginning. So, tell me, how did it all start, how did it all come out about... So, when we were in Morocco, yeah. we had fun, but not so much fun. Yeah. But then after, I was, I was, me and Gabriel were watching yeah. a movie, yeah. which is the Zorro. Yeah. At the movie, which is the Zorro. So then after, we were watching it, and after it finished, Abraham came out of the balcony, and he came and told, and, and said to 
us that um, like he said like like who's touching you and then everything like that and then we and we then we guessed and guessed and guessed and then after he said nope it's your father so then after we had an idea to tell that he just kills babies and stuff because we watched the zero okay so um we spoke a couple of times do you remember and obviously what the one rule you remembered was tell the truth yeah and don't lie. Yeah. That's the only, out of all those rules, that's the only one you remember. Yeah. So why why is it that you told me something then, which was not true? And no, because we, Abraham told me to tell, say say that. So then after that, there's more trouble because I didn't know there'll be more trouble. But he told me to say that because I was too scared of him. Oh, okay. Um, and why are you scared of him? Because he will he just hit me if I say if I say okay, then he'll just hit me because he doesn't believe me. Okay, you told me lots and lots of things there. Yeah. So what I want to start with, so you're in Morocco. Yes. You're watching Mask of Zorro. Yeah. And what is that film, Mask of Zorro? So it's all about, it's all about like pe baddies are from California and they come, and there's goodies are living in California and yeah. they build buildings and then they have like, like, um, like, uh, gunpowder yeah. all all around the all around the building, the wooden yeah. buildings. Yeah. And all the people in California are all trapped in there. Yeah. So then after the bodies had um so some people escape. Yeah. But then their bodies, their leader goes after them. Well really that's a right at the end, but at first is that when the people are all free, nothing bad happened. Okay. There were two boys and then Zer this mask of the zero he was I don't know what country it is but he but there were two boys, they lived in a place and yeah. there was a, a bad king and he and there was this prison there was not prisoners, there were good people. Because yeah. he had he took the good people into yeah. prison. Yeah. And it was, it's not like actual actual prison, so the soldiers got yeah. guns and they killed the people. The people yeah. who are in prison, well, they have um, a cloth around the eyes and then they're standing on the knees. Okay. So they, they got shot, and but then after they got saved by by two small boys and the mask of the Zorro. Okay. So his name is Zorro. Okay. And you said there's a bit where there's someone gets cut. Is that right? Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. That's in the middle. So then after the, the two boys grow yeah. up to adults and one of the four the as uh, the mark of the zero yeah the his his man yeah and he's a, and he's a hero in yeah. the film and he gives this big silver necklace to one yeah. of the boys because he helped so he they both had he yeah. had the idea to put this big set of rock and hit yeah. and hit um kill the soldiers yeah so and then after the prisoners get the the good the good the yeah. good, good people, so then they they get um all free, and then they just, they they run for their life, yeah. but then after the uh, the Zorro, uh, he he comes and gives this big necklace to the boy the oldest yeah. boy who yeah. had the idea, yeah. yes, and then after when he grew up, there's this bad man who this bad man who was from California, yeah. he looks a bit like my dad actually. We've oh just right. got long hair, like yeah. up to here. Yeah. So then after his he his buddy, yeah. he had a whole he had a whole um group of soldiers and then after he came he um he saw he knew one of the boys that were uh, one of the mm. like they were actually actual brothers yeah. of the one with the necklace. He knew that was the necklace of the Zorro, so he tried to kill him. Right. So then because it those two boy, those two boys, which yeah. are grown ups now, they were wanted down yeah. in California just because of the yeah. zero. So then after they, so then they both got caught, and then after, well, they were just cut, they were just coming to yeah. uh, California. Then the yeah. people that they had posters all around, uh, and it says um, like the, the the two boys, they look just the same, like um. The two men, they look yeah. just the same, like on a poster. So then, this, uh, so then it says wanted, and after uh, people there, they all they all catch them to try to catch them. Yeah. But then at the end, they escape. One one man escapes, but the other one gets caught by this California leader. Yeah. Yes, he gets caught. As I said, he looks like my dad. Yeah. 
No, the, the man. Yeah. No, uh, but the California leader. Yeah. And then after he he killed, well, he did. He he tried the second man. He tried to run away, but mm. then he got shot. And after, yeah, and then the bro his other brother, he tried to save him, but then he got the shot. So then after, the California leader just got out his sword and just cut off his sliced off his head. Oh, okay. And then they covered it in a whole bag. Oh, okay. A big bag and like a sack, yeah. and they took it away and just dumped it into a big hole. And then they cut the head and they took out to uh, cut off the hands. Yeah. And you've got I put them in small jars and water and they drink the water from it. Okay. So this is mask so that was the man that looks like your dad in the film done that. Okay. Um so you're watching that film and you said Abraham's come in and said who's been touching you? Yeah. And why do you think he said that? I don't know. He just came in. He did just come in, he just he came with my mum. Yeah. And he said I think he was planning to, to get me and Gabriel in trouble, I think. Yeah. But he just said, who's touching you? Who had learned you to touch each other? And, and were you touching each other? Yeah. You were? Yeah, but then after, we just watched him. My friend Sophie from my school, she touches uh, the, she, she touches me. Who? Sophie? Yeah, she's, a friend, she's my friend, but not really. Oh, okay. She just believes me and all kind of stuff. Oh, okay. And she, and she touches my private. Okay, so she's but a friend she of yours. But yes, but she's not at my friend actually. Yeah. But she, she learned me to do that because she, I don't know where she got that from, but she just done it to me. Oh, okay. So Sophie shows you how to yeah. do it. Yeah. Yes, and then that's after she. And said, what did she it. show you to do? So, so she touched me, and then I and then she said, "Touch me." So then I said, "No, that's wrong." So then after she just told me, she just took my hand and 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 just showed like just said like took my hand and like grabbed my hand. And touched it with, with to her private. Oh, okay. And after I said, "Don't do that, Sophie, or you won't be my friend." And she said she does not care. And she said to me, "She did it to my brother, and she'll give me a whole big pack of sweets." And did she? No. She said, so "She said I'll give you a big, whole big pack of sweets tomorrow if you touch your brother forever." So then I touched Gabriel. And then after the next day, when she said she'll give me a pack of sweets, yeah. He, she told me. She said, so "Then after I said." Where's the packet of sweets they told you promised me? Yeah. And she said, I'm just joking, I'll never give you a packet of sweets. Oh, okay. So that ha so Abraham's seen you touching your brother. And then what's happened? And then after when he said, Who learned you to touch? And all that. And I said, Sophie learned me to touch Gabriel. Yeah. But then he didn't believe me, so then he said, No, someone else. And then I just said, Uh, it's my. It was just Sophie and my friends. That's yeah. who they they taught to me to do yeah. that. Yeah. And he said, "No, it's your dad." So then I just, I just, but I just don't really. I've got blank. Okay. I, I just thought, why would he say my dad, even though it's not true? Okay. So did your dad teach you? And um, really, Sophie and my and okay. uh, me and Ella. So. Um, the stuff that happened in the church and the swimming pool at school, yeah. did any of that really happen? No, that was all made up. It was all Abraham made up. Me. He told me to say that and I said, why Abraham, that's not true though. Okay, so but then he said, yes that is true, so don't lie, just so say that to the police. How did you think about, like, because you told me about all like, they all dance around with baby skulls. Yes. How did you think of that because idea? They, because he went like this, they dance around with baby skulls in the church, don't they? That's what Abraham told me, and yeah. I said, "No, they don't." And he said, "Yes, they do. Stop lying, you little brat." That's what he told me. Oh, okay. So he's told you. He so said. Then after I kept on arguing with him yeah. that I didn't, and then he yeah. said that I'm not arguing with you. You did do that, stupid okay. little cunt. That's what he told me. Oh, okay. That's not very really nice, is it? Well, I thought I just thought I'll just say yes. He did do my father did okay. do that. Okay. All right. So, and then what about the stuff that happens at the swimming pool? No, it's not true. Not true. He takes us to the swimming pool, but he just plays with us with the balls there in the swimming okay. pool and other people are there. Okay. don't know who And are. so what about all your teachers and all that? They don't do it. They don't do it? They have no, they never even met my, Mr. Holland, yeah. my teacher, he never even met my dad, he doesn't even know his name. Have you been to his house? So no. that description you That's gave of the house. That's why remember that time 
that time when we were when we when you took us to to the to to to, 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 to me for me and gave it to show yeah. the house. Yeah. That's why we didn't show the house because we didn't know where. Okay. So we just thought just we just thought to do like a spare place. Yeah. But we didn't know which house. We just okay. just choose any. And what happened? Because you went out before that, didn't you, with your mum? Yeah, mom. that's why he was so fed up with me and Gabriel yeah. that, that we didn't show the house. That's why we keep on like like saying, uh, it's over there. And, but then they, she said, my mum and Abraham said, no, that's a building where people work. Oh, and okay. after I just got in trouble, so then... What do you mean you got in trouble? So then they, they hurt me a lot and then they said, Let's go back home and then the police... They what you a lot, sorry? They hurt me a lot. How? So, they, they call me bad, bad words, bad words which hurt my feelings oh, a lot. Right. Yeah. And then they hurt me with the spoon because they, he said that he will take the spoon just in case. Okay. That's why I uh, keep keeping... And whose car did you go in? My mo uh, uh, it's not in, it's not our car, it's Who's a taxi. Oh, you in a taxi? Like a taxi knows about it. And what taxi did you get? Do you know where it's from? It's a normal cab. I don't know where from. What car was it? Do you know? This is black normal cab. Black cab. And where did you pick this cab up from? I don't know. It's his friend. His friend Rob works in there. Rob. Oh, okay. So you've gone in this taxi. You've driven around and you couldn't see it. Mm, and then after, it was then after, she told me to. My mum told me to show Mr. Hollings' house. And I was like, um, it's just over there down yeah. that road. And then it was just loads of houses lined yeah. up. And then she said, and then after Gabriel went with her to show the house. But then after, um, you know, I stayed with Abraham in a taxi. Yeah. And then when they came back, my mum took me and then she said that I, that is not, that's the wrong road. That's not Highgate or anything. Okay. So you told, when we spoke, you told me a lot about Mr. Holling's house. Didn't you? you described yeah, everything about, true. and you because told me what, even what telly you had. What made you choose that telly? Because at tennis, we go to tennis, and yeah. they have a Samsung. Is that why? Yeah. Okay. But you know about this wardrobe, with secret doors? Yeah. Kind of, because that's from the Zara, Master of the Zara movie. It's from Master yeah, Zara. Because this uh, California, this Cal the lead of California. Yeah. He got this kind of secret passageway yeah. from the wardrobe. I just saw that, and then there was one of ah. the good people peeked at him would go to the passageway so when he went out of the room they went in the passageway and it got oh, caught and then see. after they got the cut off uh, the head cut off oh, I see head. I see that makes sense now um what else come on you, you've been to the doctors twice didn't they yeah you've been to the doctors twice yeah and they but said then I was like I was really hoping that they'll find some scars or something why and they did find some scars I don't have no um. idea why you don't know why? No, I had no idea why. I was like hoping. I was hoping for. Why was you hoping they'd find something? Because then I, because then they'll say, you do not have any scars. So then I thought I'll get in trouble for not because I don't have uh, scars. Then there will be not. Then there will be is. Then I'll get in trouble for okay. not. Then as has anyone ever put anything into your bum? What about into your, you call it your front bum as well? What about into your front bum? No, it's only it's only Abraham who kicks my private. He kicks your privates. What do you mean? So whenever, because he in Morocco, he had his big boots. Yeah. Because it's muddy there. Yeah. Because it's in the mountains, so he got he just kicked me right in my front private. Oh, okay. And then my and then to, to my bottom. Okay. But I keep on. That's why I'm so used to it. That's why I keep on like going like that and then keep on running away from him when he got his boots on. Right. I see. But then he is, he's faster than me, so he just comes after me yeah. as well and just. Me. And you told me about a lot about plastic willies and that was all not true because Sophie, Where, how did you know about Sophie, it? Because Sophie, yeah. she has an iPad Mini and she like she likes sexy stuff and all this and she showed me a picture of plastic willies sticking the bomb. Oh right. So I got the idea of that because oh. I was thinking it was in year three. Oh, in year three on her iPad Mini. right now. Oh, okay. So I just remembered it from memory straight away and then I just said. Uh, you know, I but you know, I they stick plastic quillies in my bottom. You know. Abraham. So how did Gabriel know about all that? Because I told him. Because that time, when well, because that time I told Gabriel that day when she, Sophie showed me an iPad yeah. Mini, that he, she showed me this kind of stuff. 
Ooh, that's, yeah, that's yucky what she done. So can I make sure, so your dad's never done anything you don't like? He's fine and he's a good. Okay. So, um, you made this up because... Because of all the stuff I, I just remembered what I saw and all, everything. But it's just okay. all because of Abraham because he keep on hitting me, telling me. What do you mean keep on hitting you? Well, he keeps on like saying like, like... I'm gonna not live with them. I'm gonna. He's gonna he dig a hole in in the field and dig me into it, and then just leave me there and and till I die, yeah. and till I drown because they're gonna put water on top of me. Okay. And after I got too scared. And where did all this happen? In Morocco. Did it happen in England at all? No, it was in Morocco. All in Morocco. Yes, all in the middle of our holidays. Okay. So has he ever done anything in England? No. Always in my mind. He never knew that. Okay. When he was in. Okay. And you know when he said that, he, did he still tell you that he heard the, his, my father's voice? I've heard something about on Skype. No, because he said that, he said that he heard his voice on Skype. Yeah. Yeah, that was not true. That's not true. And then he says that I am lying because he says, I can see through you, Elisa, that you're lying. And I, I, don't, I don't believe that. Yeah. I think this is what he does. He believes in lies, yeah. not in truth. He doesn't believe in truth, just lies. Uh, okay. Because I lied to him all this time. Because okay. that's why I keep on saying, changing things. So I keep on saying, uh, my father done that and then done that. And then after, I keep on changing things because I didn't know what to say. That's why I keep on getting hurt. Okay. And that's why he thought I was lying. Okay. So I'll make this, so you... You hurt your ear as well, the doctor said. There's something wrong with your ear, is that right? No, but also I, got, I had an infection like a long time ago. Oh, right. So I had a big, I don't know what it was, but it was an infection. There was a big black mark on my ear inside. Okay. So then I had a special spray and I had to spray it in my ear okay. every single day. Did anyone else have that in your family? No, it was only me. So that's infection. why your ears, so you had an ear infection. No, you don't know why there's scars on your bum? But it's not because anyone's no, been thinking. No, I don't even. I don't know. I don't, maybe when I was little and when I was saying the bath, I think I, I don't remember. But maybe I slipped or something. Okay. When I was coming out of the bath right. and Holly Croft Avenue. So, the other two things when we spoke a lot, none of that's true. Well, that's yes. But the thing is, when he when he just started, I just was fed up. No, I was I just understand. thinking that. I don't care if I go to jail. I think I deserve to go to jail for lying so much. You shouldn't. No, as I to remember, what I've always told you that as long as you tell me everything, you won't get in trouble. Yeah, but all and that's about still that true church, now. All about that church. All about the, yeah. the um, what's his name? Father Paul's uh, room. It's all yeah. not true. All not true. Okay. That's why I was so worried that. Uh, that's why I was so worried that you won't find any skulls in rooms. Okay. The rooms are, are true, not the secret rooms. Yeah, no. But the the ace, the, uh, the, the nursery room, all of that is true. And then I was so scared that you won't find the scars in in the um, church. So then I was so scared and worried. It's fine. It's fine. But are you telling me the truth now? Yeah, that's true. Good. So you said it because Abraham kept going on you. You said he, Abraham has hit you. And kicked you. Yes, that's why. Right. Said things, but that's all in Morocco. Was the whole problem. That was all in Morocco. He was the whole problem. He made the. He just. I didn't know. He just. I didn't know he what he'd done. Okay, and why has your mum let this happen? Why do you think your mum's let him? My speak mum to believes. You? She believes in lies too, like okay. Abraham. And um, where was she when he kicked you? She was just like at the front of Abraham. Okay, and why do you think she let him do it? Did she try and stop it, or...? No, she never done that. Never. Why? Never, ever. She'll never do that. Why not? No, because... She, well, it's because she, she, she loves him so much. Yeah. That she she never shouts at Abraham. Yeah. But Abraham, when he's angry with me and Gabriel, when he yeah. says we lie... Yeah. Then he says swear words out in front of my mind. Okay. So, and before Abraham was in the house, I know... You, when we met you, was a, you was vegan, wasn't you? Raw vegan, is yeah. that right? And what was you before Abraham come in? No, even before, we were still raw vegan. I was, yeah. My mum, but she never put nettles, grass, or anything yeah. in, 
and juices or anything. She has to put like apples yeah. all kind of stuff in. And she used to buy us vegan, vegetarian, jelly beans, vegetarian yeah. sausage rolls, like, and, but not cereal, not always. Yeah. She bought a box of cereal, but only a tiny bit, maybe three times a week. Okay. Something like that, but not always. And then right. after, but since we were six or six or five, yeah. she used to buy us cereal. But then after, when we were eight, nine, eight and nine, yeah, then she stopped buying cereals and all stuff. Okay. And um, with that, you call Abraham Papa Hemp, don't you? Yeah, he told us to. Why is that? Because he keeps on saying, I saved you, Elisa, so you better call me Papa Hemp. Okay, he saved you. How did he save you? He said that he saved us from my father. Okay. And I thought that was just so stupid what he said. Do you like calling him Papa Hemp? Okay. He said he's my father, real father. And what and do you think? And he lied about that. And then he lied about him being my mum's sister. No, his mom, my mum's brother. To who? So he lied to me and Gabriel. He said that, that he's my mum's brother. Oh, okay. Which is not true. I thought okay. that is so not true. My mum would have been black like him. Yeah, okay. And then my, my grandma my grandma will be black like him too. Yeah, yeah. And her and his father oh, well actually yeah, his father and his mother should have been would have been black. Uh, well my mother's mum and father yeah. they would have been black too. Okay. If if Abraham wasn't my mum's brother. Okay. If she, if they weren't, if she was, if he wasn't my yeah. mom's brother, then he'll be what? Uh, well, he will be brown, and my mom will be white. Okay. And what do you think about Abraham now? I think he's just. Mm, I don't mean to be rude, but I think he's just an idiot. Okay. And what? Um, and why is it you're able to tell me now, and you wasn't be able to tell me before with Abraham? Because I, uh, I thought that because I before I was uh, I was too scared to tell. Yeah. Oh but then yeah. after when you mentioned that if it's true or not about the babies, then I wanted to tell because then I I thought you'll never believe me then. Okay. Then well, like, like before, but then when you mentioned it, yeah. then I thought you might believe me. Do you think you'd been caught out to you? Or? No, I thought I would get in big trouble for like saying all kind of stuff like that and that and that. Mm. Yeah. Okay, as I said, you're not in trouble, um, but thank you. No. And where is it you'd like to stay, if you could Carol. choose? And Carol's. Not Carl's, Carol's, yeah? Carol's. Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, what we'll do, we'll have a little break. I'm just going to have a chat with Carl, just quickly, just to make sure there's nothing else we need. And then I'll have a chat with your brother, okay? Is that all right? Yeah. You can watch a bit of Harry Potter or something while you're waiting, alright? Just give me two minutes, just wait here while I speak to Carl.
sorry. Um, just one minute. Um, just one or two questions. Just we talked a lot about Abraham and all that. And what about your mum? Does she know about whether or not this is a truth or a lie? What you've been no, telling? No, no. My mum believes in Abraham. Abraham says to my mum, "It's all true." And she believes it. And why do you think she believes it? But really, she's not doing anything. She's just saying like she's she's not saying anything really. No. She she's just or she's just like nodding whenever Abraham says that. Do they do that? Do they do that? My mum keeps on when I say no. It's not true. It's not true about that. Yeah. And then she says, and then she nods at Abraham. And then she, and then she, she just says, and she nods at everything that what Abraham says. Okay, so she just agrees with whatever yeah. Abraham says. Okay. Is there anything you'd like to ask me? Is there? Mm. What are you gonna do with my mum? What, what are you gonna do with Abraham and my mum? They obviously need to be asked about why, because I've spoken to your mum a couple of times, and um, I've told her off about asking you questions about it already because I don't think it's fair that she should be asking you certain things because I felt that she's putting under pressure I thought she's putting under pressure so that's what's happened so far that I've told your mum off already about speaking to you about it and although she wasn't happy with that I didn't think it was fair that she kept asking you and your brother really I thought it was better that I ask you um, so I've spoken to her there and How about Abraham? Abraham, the same as well, I've told him. I've told him about and I've I've told him that it's not fair about the spoon. And that's why he had to go to stay with Carol because of what I wasn't happy. But no, he's he's in a, in a, another house living now. But how it's where we need to know and be sure that that's for forever. Do you see what no, I mean? No, I just want, I just want, a, I can let my mum and Abraham live in Bypass. I know. Bypass road. Sorry? I can let my mum and Abraham live in Bypass Road together. Yeah. So there's no need really for him to go to Okay. Well, it might be that your mum wants you back. Do you see what I mean? So, at the moment, you don't think. Okay, well, well I'm to. sure it'll all, it'll all come out really of what's going to happen. And also, we need to get your dad's opinion as well about where he thinks you should stay, don't we? No, so he's just my mum and, I, and my mum and her father will just say no, they want me and Gabriel, and that's all. Yeah. But that's I, they're just gonna do just um Abraham and my mum are gonna just just because Abraham is not gonna just stay forever with his with in that house where he's gonna live. He's just gonna come and visit us every single day. Yeah. That's what he will do. Okay. I know that because yeah. last time, when it was since we met him, he met us every single day when he was living in another okay. house. Is that what you think will happen? Yes, okay. I know that will happen. All right. Well, I'll we'll bear that in mind when we everything decided what has to happen. Um, at the moment, it's just, it's eleven five minutes past eleven. Okay, I'll pop you next door. Then I'm going to have a chat with your brother. Is that all right? Yeah. Come on.